Sziasztok! Szép estét kívánok! Kellemes péntek estét! Ritka alkalom, hogy péntek este van stream, de ma van, úgyhogy ez alkalommal megnézzük a Forgotten City nevű játékot. Ti kértétek? Én nagyon kíváncsi vagyok. Picit utána olvastam, de tényleg csak tehát nem a sztorit meg ilyesmit, hanem úgy nagyjából milyen. Üm, biztos vagyok benne, hogy, hogy tetszeni fog. De ezt majd a végén elmondom. Úgyhogy üm, meglátjuk. Sziasztok, szép estét! Ó, oh, para! Köszönöm szépen ismét az ötöst. Üm, nagyon kedves. Köszönöm szépen a támogatást. Hát igen, ö, hétvégi Miller a csak a szokásos. Na, ö, szerintem nézzük is meg akkor. Ez gyors volt. Amúgy ennyi idő, még egy játék elindul, csak mondom. Még, még föl se készültem szellemileg, hogy, hogy itt játék lesz. Egészségetekre. Na, nézzük akkor. Oké, okay. és akkor itt van a kérés a fejlesztőktől, hogy szóljak, amikor a White Hallway-hez érünk, hogy spoiler, jó, régenben ez úgy volt, hogy nem igazán engedték, hogy végigjátszák online például, azt hiszem, hát én amit néztem Youtube-on Kokkárnicsnak a streamjét, végig se játszottam emiatt, tehát megállt itt a White Hallway-nél. Gondolom azóta ez változott, azért ez már egy régebbi, hát mármint, hogy nem régi game, de azóta eltelt egy kis idő. De mindegy, amikor a White Hallway-hez érünk, amit még nem tudom, hogy micsoda, akkor majd szólok, hogy spoiler warning. Sziasztok! Igen, 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 ezért Miller te, mert hogy... Mert hogy az... Na, benézek a settingsbe, csak hogy ne legyen itt semmi disznóság. Én azt javaslom, hogy németül játszunk. Nem. Nem. Jó, marad az angol. Uh, oké, oké. Subtitles, yes. Normál, no. Oké. Uh, oké, oké. Franciára azért nem merem állítani, mert akkor lebukok, hogy mégse tudok. Pedig van nyelvvizsgám belőle. Ezt hangosan mondtam? Jó, ez biztos jó lesz. Ezen majd állítunk, ha nem jó. És véletlenül azt olvastam, hogy buildings, ez viszont nekünk nem fog kelleni, mert hogy kontrollerre játszunk. Ó. Oh. És megint, megint nem... Oké. Okay. Uh, új baget, új messzél. Na, hát akkor kezdjük. Három ember fejlesztette négy év alatt. Többféle befejezés van. Conversation, Exploration. A gyors olvasást meg majd megtanulom idővel. Ez a jelen. 
Tehát a jelenbe kezdünk. Igen, a omlet du fromage, az is jó. Hey! You're alive! When I dragged you out of the river, I thought you were never gonna wake up. I checked your pockets for ID, a phone, maybe? I hope you don't mind. But all I found was some loose change. So, huh. wanna tell me who you are? Okay. Hát nem tudom mi a különbség. Ja, férfi vagy nő. Igen. Mármint, hogy gondolom. Legyen nő, fehér. Ó, várjatok. Akkor ezt billentyűzettel kell, legyen jó, Jeff. Ja, nem, mert nő vagyunk, várja. Akkor... Well, it's nice to meet you. And I'm sorry to pry, but any idea why you were floating down the river? What's the last thing you remember? Uh, that means the last thing we remember. Yeah, and then I can do this. Oké, okay, és tehát lehetünk archeológusok, vagy magyarul régészek, katonák, szökevények, vagy semmi nem emlékszünk. Na nézzük, hogy mi az előnye. Occasional insights into ancient world, tehát így akkor a régi világból, hát igen, valamit ismerünk, oké. Okay. Tehát van egy... Lőfegyverünk, de csak 10 történjel. Oké, okay, okosan kell használnunk, mert több történjünk nem lehet. Hát, én lövöldözni nem, nem akarnék. Bár majd meglátjuk, persze. Szökemény. Oké, okay, tehát a sprint az 25%-a gyorsabb. És nem emlékszünk semmire. Pain threshold 50%-kal nehezebb ö, levinni minket a földre. Hát én maradnék a régésznél, az ön tudósabbnak hangzik. Oh, you're an archaeologist? Then you'll definitely want to hear this. I don't know if it's exactly what you're looking for, but there are some ruins just behind you. Roman, I think. Roman, I need you to go in there and see if you can find a guy named Al for me. He went in there a few hours ago, and he hasn't come out. I've been freaking out, wondering if he's trapped, or injured, or worse. I would have gone in after him, but he made me promise to stay here, no matter what. There's no way I'm leaving without him. So I'm just kind of... stuck here, waiting. I need... what I mean is, I was hoping... you wouldn't mind going in there to find him? If you can do that... I can get both of you back to civilization in my boat. Please? Mm -hmm. Oh, of course. Sorry, I don't mean to be pushy. I just... What do you want to know? Okay, I'll ask you this idegen. Oh, there's not much to tell. Feels like I've spent my whole life in a dead end job with an endless commute. Know what I mean? Oh, uh, I'd rather not say if it's all the same to you. All right, fine. Sorry if I sounded cagey, it's just that. I don't always get the best reactions when I introduce myself. My name's Karen. Karen. Hmm. Hát azt mondjuk, oké, okay, tehát Karennek hívják. Minden Karen mém tönkretette ezt a nevet. Can I talk to the manager? Oké, okay, uh, hát köszönjük, hogy... Uh, 
megmentette az életünket. Szívesen. Ki az az L? He's the guy who washed up on the riverbank not long before you did. I thought maybe you two knew each other. I guess not. But maybe the two of you can piece together what you're doing here. In any case, you'll like him, I'm sure. Once you find him, that is. Uh huh. Okay, that it is a part from the photo. Nem sokkal előttünk. Hol vagyunk? You really don't remember? We're in Italy. Ennyi. This river is the Tiber. Oké, okay. mindegy, Olaszország vagyunk, mindig is Olaszországba akartam menni, úgyhogy ez tök jó. Um, mit tudom elmondani erről a, ezekről a romokról? Not much, really. But imagine what you might find in there. Priceless ancient artifacts. Al. Te semmit nem tud, de megtaláltunk egy csomó ilyen régiséget és elt. Próbáltál segítséget hívni? What am I, an idiot? You could hike a long, long way in any direction and never find another soul. Trust me. Oké, tehát a környékben semmi nincs, és valószínűleg senki. Ennyi kérdés, más kérdésünk. Great. So you're ready to go look for Al? Hát, ha azt mondom, hogy állj persze, akkor vége a játéknak. Thank you. The entrance is just past those columns behind you. Please, hurry. Okay. Oh, and he left this here. But I think you'll need it more than I will. Oh, a flashlight. Super. Okay, yo. Yo. Oké is. Na, itt vannak a ruinszok, vagy a romok, ezzel tudunk flashlightolni. Hm. Úgy ö, elég tetszetős, egyelőre legalábbis. Oké, na gyerünk. Első quest kész. Oké, okay, próbáljunk meg, meg eh, nyomokat keresni. Tehát elnyoma itt kéne esetleg. Hmm. Oké, okay. ezzel tudunk sprintelni. Remélem olyan sokat nem fog majd kell, nem, nem fog kelleni sprintelni. Oké. Okay. Rögtön elmegyek a rossz irányba. Lehet ugrani is, nagyon jó. Oké. Okay. Na, próbáljunk egy előre az ősvényen maradni. Egy backpack. Um, ilyen túrázós ruhákkal van tele, meg üres uh, kajászacsikkal. Semmi értékes. Minden esetre furcsa, hogy el itt hagyta. Mindegy visszatesszük, ha netán visszajönne érte, akkor legyen meg. Oké. Okay. Oh. If you're reading this, it means I've discovered the entrance to an ancient Roman city hidden deep underground. Its existence is long forgotten. All knowledge of it lost, except in the Latin inscription here. It reads, "You who wish to enter the city, step forth and be judged." Um. Okay. El hagyott nekünk egy üzenetet, és az az tette ez a. The virtuous shall be rewarded with eternal life in paradise. The wicked shall find themselves showered in gold, but in vain. For this shall be their final resting place. 
an underground city have remained a secret for all this time? Could people have survived down there, against the odds? Seems there's only one way to find out. If I'm not back in an hour, I'm somewhere on the other side. Consider this an invitation. Hmm. Or a warning. Al Worth. Oké, tehát akkor ez egy ilyen uh, underground city. Uh, egy régi római. Na jó, hát... Uh, keressük meg Eld. Ez egy gladiátor. Miért menekül? Hm. Ez egy jó kérdés. Oké. Hát szobor az van, nem kevés. Jó, jövünk tovább. Ó. Oh. Hát igen, itt, itt uh, valami történt. Oké, okay, van quick save, de mondjuk van benne auto save is. Érdekes, hogy van mindkettő. Na mindegy, majd ha úgy értékeljük, hogy menteni kell, akkor majd mentünk. Hát elég jól néz ki egyébként, tehát szé szép a játék. Lehet, hogy nem város nézni vagyunk. Oké. Okay. Nem tudom, mit néz. Egyelőre nem ugrok le. Ez a suttogás, ez... Ez, ez, ez vészjósló. Azt nem lehet mondani neki, hogy elt keressük. Basszus. Oh. To whoever reads this, I'm sorry you had to find me like this. And worse, she'll suffer the same fate I did. I spent a lifetime in this place, going around and around in circles, searching for a way out. The inscription was right. There is no way back. Mm. Here, there are only two options. Death, or that godforsaken doorway into the past. I made the mistake of stepping through it. I wanted to set things right. And I tried. I really tried. Whatever I did, took me right back to the beginning. Don't make the same mistake. Better to end it all now and find out what awaits you beyond that portal. Hmm. Tehát mindig körbe-körbe, mert nem tudod kijutni innen. Hmm. És akkor ez egy doorway, tehát egy ajtó a múltba. Ha jól értem. 
Mindjárt megnézzük szerintem. Miért is ne néznénk meg. Mi váratlan lyuk a falon? Nem bízok az ilyen hangokban. Régen se bíztam, és egy ideje már nagyon nem, nem bízok bennük. <gül> Jó, na nézzük meg. Oké, okay. hát visszajöttünk a múltba. Hello. Uh, salve, friend. I'm Galerius. Mind telling me who you are and what you were doing in the shrine of Proserpina? Proserpina. Hát igen, mondjuk ez a legjobb kérdés így most. Yeah, you know, agricultural goddess of springtime? You're not from around here, are you? Oh, I see what you did there, changing the subject like that. Nice try. But I'll ask again, who are you and what were you doing in the shrine? Hát most mondjam azt, hogy a jövőből jöttem, és hülyének fog nézni. Oh, is that right? Well, just make sure you don't get lost in any other sacred places you're not supposed to be. Can't have you disrespecting the gods by accident, can we now? But listen, most folks seem a bit confused when they get here, but you... you seem very lost, and in more ways than one. So, let me make this nice and simple for you. Live by our law here, and we'll all get along just fine. Not Értettem. laws, law. There's just one, the golden rule, and the punishment for breaking it's, well, it's kind of horrific. But our magistrate insists we take all newcomers to see him, so I guess I'll let him fill you in. So then, are you coming? Yo, de mi az a golden rule? Na mindegy, menjünk. When I first arrived, I couldn't believe there were people living down here, but as you can see. We've got a nice little community now. Only 23 of us at the moment, if you count the three who are missing. No idea how, since nobody knows a way out. But it's just big and dark enough to get lost in, if you're not careful. Aren't you going to introduce me to your pretty new friend, Galerius? Keep it in your loincloth, Aurelia. I'm taking her to see the magistrate. That pompous old boar won't be magistrate for much longer. Anyone who helps vote him out today, Drinks at my bar for free tonight. Uh, politics. I'd stay clear of it and her if I were you. She's, uh, it's not my place to say. Down on your right is our farm, where I grow all the food you'll ever want. As long as all you want is leek, cabbage, and wheat. Huh, that one usually gets a chuckle. The bloodless shadows wander without flesh or bone. Ah. Don't mind Livia. She means well. She's just been in a bad place since. Well, you know, I don't know what happened to her. Up here on your right is the chasm. If you've got a weapon, it belongs way down at the bottom. Up on your left is the forum, where you can visit the market or get yourself patched up in Lucretia's clinic in the shrine of Apollo. Most of us have almost nothing, just what we had on us when we arrived, and what we've been able to make and scrounge up since. And this central plateau is where the magistrate and the other patricians live. So don't expect a warm welcome. Galerius, 
You're meant to be working the farm, not trudging dirt into the pillars. Take it easy, Horatius. I was just taking our new friend here to see the magistrate. Well, he's asked me to escort the newcomer personally. The farm. Go. Now. You'd better go with him. But just remember, they're not like you and me. Don't let them use you. Mm -hmm. What was that? What did you just say? Uh, I said it'll take some getting used to. Yeah, I'm watching you, farm boy. Greetings, citizen. My name's Horatius. Magistrate Sentius asked me to escort you to him personally. Follow me, please. Okay. Hú, az az info tolta a fickó. Nem keveset. Közben stop soros nagyon szépen köszönöm az újabb sub giftet, amit most ezúttal tuba kapott meg. Az ő nevében is nagyon szépen köszönöm a támogatást. Köszi szépen. Oké, tehát Horácius. És Sentius a magisztrátus. Igen. Menjünk. The only thing you really need to understand right now is the golden rule. Let me see if I can explain it this way. No, I should. When I was serving in the Legion, if there was a mutiny brewing in one cohort, the legate in charge wouldn't waste time finding the bad apples among hundreds. They just divided us into groups of ten, made us draw straws, and whoever drew the short straw had to be executed by the other nine. Didn't matter whether he'd done anything wrong. One of us in ten would die for the crimes of the collective. We call it decimation. If that seems like rough justice to you, you're in for a rude shock. Because the golden rule is exactly ten times worse. The magistrate can explain the rest. Who's up these stairs? Mm hmm Okay. Hello. Uh, this place has become a thoroughfare. At the key wide. Oh, I wish Horatius would stop letting barbarians in here. What do you want? I'm Sentia, eldest daughter of the Magistrate. But you'd know that if you'd been invited in here and introduced properly. What are you doing in here? And why are you dressed like that? Really? I'd never have noticed what with your flawless accent, appropriate attire and impressive mastery of our customs. Now remind me, why are we having this conversation? De most miért ilyen pokróc egyébként? I trust you can see yourself out. Később majd beszélgetünk. Na lássuk a főnököt. Na. Hello. We're finally alone. I assume you already know who I am. May I know your name? A curious name to match a curious accent. But I digress. I see you have the piercing and astute eyes of Athena. You must be a woman of great learning. Absolutely. We're always happy to welcome another scholar to our little community. Equitia will be delighted to meet you, I'm sure. Now, you're probably wondering why I summoned you, and I'll get to that. But first, take a look at this wondrous place, would you? A secret city built deep in the mountains many hundreds of years ago. Indeed. More importantly, consider the miraculous community we've built here over the last seven months. Twenty-two complete strangers brought together by the fates, living and working together in our own little paradise. Mm -hmm. And in all that time, not a single sin has been committed. No fights, no theft, nothing. Have you ever witnessed something so extraordinary as a city without sin? Nor could I, until I came here. But the reason for this, this miracle, is as simple as it is terrifying. If even one person commits a sin here, every last one of us will die. You see, the builders of this place, whoever they were, left inscriptions warning, the many shall suffer for the sins of the one. 
From what we can gather, breaking the law here will anger the gods hmm. and provoke a terrible punishment. Like the curses of Medusa and Midas combined, turning us all to gold. We've come to call it the Golden Rule. It's extraordinary that we've survived as long as we have, and each day I grow more and more afraid that our time in the sun is almost up. I see it, Nikish. And now it seems that day is finally here. All that matters is that somebody in this city is about to break the Golden Rule. Why else would Proserpina send you now? Unless you and I can stop them, our doom is assured. I know that's a lot to take in, and you look like you have questions. Please, ask away. Tehát, hogyha valakit bármilyen bűnt követel, akkor mindenki meghal. Az vagány. The secret ingredient is crime. Ah, jó. Oké, mi számít bűnnek? Intelligent question. There was a good deal of debate about that in our first weeks here. Does it refer to crimes or to some other ill-defined wrong? Of course, everyone agrees on the basics. No theft, no assault, and certainly no murder. But beyond that, it was more difficult to reach a consensus. What about lying, insulting someone, blasphemy, trespass, trying to escape, bribery, infidelity, suicide? As magistrate, I had to exercise leadership, and so I made a decision. We must uphold the laws of the Empire to a standard never before seen. And we must honor the peace of the gods, the sacred accord between the gods and the people of Rome. It is only by offering the gods the proper respect that we may prosper, as Rome has for centuries. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oké, okay. hát igen, alapvetően akkor ö, végül is a birodalomnak a, a szabályait követik, csak egy kicsit magasabb ö, szinten, ha jól értettem. Viszont, ö, hát igen, ebbe is van valami, hogy ami ott akkor legálisnak számított, az, ö, vagy ilyen szokások, azok ma már elég ilyen barbárnak tűnhetnek. Hát igen. Barbaric? What are you talking about? The Empire is the most civilizing force in the known world. Rome is a beacon of light in the darkness. For 800 years she has borne great statesmen, philosophers, poets, artists and engineers. We have comprehensive laws protecting the rights of our citizens, which have unified countless warring tribes all across the Mediterranean and beyond, from Gallia to Judea. All our citizens are treated the same, regardless of the color of their skin or their sexual preference. Can you say the same? When our people are starving, they are given food rations, and when they are wronged, they have the right to bring the guilty party before the magistrate. Our laws forbid treason, murder, assault and rape, as well as theft and arson and so on. No other civilization in the world is so advanced, and you have the, the hubris to call us barbaric? Hát igen, és akkor itt van pár példa, ugye a rabszolgaság, ugye ez a blood sports, tehát gondolom ez a gladiátor játékok, a nőknek kevesebb joga van, mint a férfiaknak, Hát igen, ez, ez is így volt. Akkor ez a, a keresztények keresztény üldözés. Persze ki jut, mondjuk. És ugye ez a kollektív punishment. Hát igen. Azt mondod, hogy my mistake? Hát lehet, hogy tényleg nem kéne az óra alá dörgölni, de mondjuk én a rabszolgaságot azért megemlíteném neki, hogy... Of course. What else would we do with those prisoners of war who would otherwise have been executed? And besides, there are laws for their protection as well. Mm. Tehát mindenre van egy jó magyarázata. Nézzük akkor a rabszolgaságot. 
but our gladiators are almost all volunteers seeking glory, or condemned prisoners who would have been executed anyway. I do not see the harm. Tehát szóval ugye a legtöbb gladiátor önkéntes, vagy elítélt uh, rabok tulajdonképpen, akiket amúgy is kivégeznének. Igen, Stopsoros tiszta kormány info, hogy teszem fel a kérdéseket, és jönnek a, a válaszok. Um, hát igen, amúgy a... De azért ez, ez sem feltétlenül így volt, mondjuk aki látta a Gladiátor című filmsorozatot. Gladiátor, ez volt a címe, mindig elfe... nem Gladiátor. Mi volt a cím? A HBO ment a... Nem Gladiátor volt. Vagy igen? Spartacus, persze. Bocsánat, Spartacus. Igen, igen, igen. Na, tehát ott azért, azért voltak uh, itt tárnyalatok. Na, a nőknek kevesebb joga van. Ennyi. Ennyire egyszerű. Tehát kevesebb jog, jog kevesebb felelősség. Na, lássuk. You mean the blasphemous cult responsible for burning down half of Rome last year? It's hard to blame the people for being angry about that. Hmm. Are you talking about our practice of decimation? Of course. We could hardly unite all these warring tribes without a disciplined, formidable legion. Well, right now, you're alone long way from home. I have made my pronouncement on the subject. Unfortunately, there are still those here who resist, whispering blasphemous and treasonous lies in the shadows. I would be keeping a close eye on them if I were you. Okay. Uh, okay, mit értünk az alatt, hogy Rospina küldött? You see, in my search for a way to save my people, I learned of an ancient ritual to Proserpina, the goddess of the cycle of life and renewal. It's said to open a doorway in time, so that if the unthinkable happens, one person can pass through it and travel back to the past. And when I saw you arrive in a flash of light from the goddess's shrine, I knew that person was you. You don't belong in our time, do you? Hát ez egy okos embernek tűnik. 2000 years? That is unfathomable. Please tell me in your time. What did you see? What had become of the uh, city? Nem akarunk most még hazudni. I have imagined it. Our downfall a thousand times, but it still breaks my heart to hear the truth of it. Ha Rómába járok, tegyek úgy, mint a rómaiak? Tehát törjem le a másik autó tükrét? Vagy, vagy mi legyen? How does the ritual work? All I can tell you is that it's a ritual sacrifice to Proserpina. I stumbled across instructions. I have to recite a prayer, and of course, as with all rituals, some sacrifice is involved. Usually that means wine or food, or in some cases a live animal. In this case, the sacrifice is rather more costly. The life of the person performing the ritual. I don't suppose you saw any sign of me in the future? Hát láttunk uh, emberi baradványokat. Ah, I assume that was me. If I'm forced to perform the ritual, it's going to cost me everything. You'll try to make sure I don't need to use it, won't you? Hát, uh, well, yeah. I suppose that's all I can ask for. Igyekszünk uh, nem feláldozni a fickót. I believe you're in the best position to go around asking people questions. You're new here, and it will seem perfectly normal. As for me, well, it pains me to say my attempts to impose order have not earned me many friends. 
I fear I may not even remain magistrate after today's election. Oh, I'm a violent I only treat my curiosity with suspicion. You shouldn't have that problem, though. Unless, of course, you get off on the wrong foot. Oké, okay, jó, jó, akkor kör, nekünk kell körbe kérdezősködni. Hát nyilván nem neki, mert akkor a játéknak nem, ne, nem lenne túl izgalmas. Jó, van egy gyanús ítot. Do you ever stare at a problem for so long that you can't see it for what it is anymore? What's needed here is a fresh pair of eyes. The less I prejudice the independence of your investigation, the better. Mm -hmm. Okay, de mire gondol? Well, all right. There are those who wish to vote me out of office so that they can pursue their own misguided political agenda. Hmm. Frankly, their selfishness and recklessness risk destabilizing the entire city. I would be looking very carefully at them if I were you. Ah, oh, tök jó, hogy politizálni kell, nek nagyon örülök. If I understand Proserpina's ritual correctly, that problem should take care of itself. And let me see if I can explain. No. If you manage to prevent the sin that breaks the golden rule, I won't need to bring you here. I won't create the portal, and you will never have been able to come here. Thus, you'll have created a paradox. If this occurs, you should be flung back to your own time, having changed the past for all of us. Makes sense. Shimaliba. Okay. Yo, that. Okay. Is that what the questions are going to be about? Should we do that? That's what I'm going to do. Because if I have to move on, then that's okay. Again, it seems like this is going to be a time loop kind of thing. Ha az ók... Hát figyelj, Edith Adri, hogy ha az ókori Rómában járok, akkor majd igyekszem betartani a szabályaikat. Um, amit tudok, mindenképp odafigyelek rá. Így van, és az a vége, hogy meg sem történt, amit láttunk. Mert akkor nem, jönni, nem jövünk ide, mert nincs ránk szükség. Tehát meg kell akadályoznunk ezt a bűnt, hogy elkövessék. Ah, good. So, are you with me? Can I count on you to figure out who's about to break the golden rule? Wonderful. Now, I need you to investigate the city, talk to everyone, help them if it will win their trust. I authorize you to enter private homes and inspect possessions and documents, unless of course you're asked to leave. Figure out who the culprit is, and as soon as you have a name, come back and tell me immediately. Oh, and one last thing. If I were you, I'd start my investigation by visiting Lucretia at the Shrine of Apollo in the Forum. I heard wailing from there not long ago. It seems like something's not right. Okay. Jó, tehát Lukréciához kell mennünk. Ó, oh, oké. Okay. Miért kattant? Oké, okay, tehát itt vannak a main gólok, meg nyomok. Valami gond van Apollo ö, ö, emlékművénél, Shrine, Kápolna, Kinda, valami. És azt kell kiderítenünk, hogy mi bántja Lukréciát. Hmm. Oké, okay, itt vannak a Complete Questek, itt meg az aktív Questek. Van Inventoring is. Van egy... Denarius... Denar? Mi is annak a neve? Hát majd veszünk belőle egy kávét. Van a flashlight, meg ez a stone, ez a kőtábla. Igen, igen, ezt a elírta. Dénár, aha. Oké. Okay. Erre mi van? Szerintem 
Sentila Sanchez-nak. Thank you for making me your daughter. Tehát választások lesznek hamarosan. Ja, mert adoptál, uh, tehát örökbe fogadta. Oké, okay, oké, okay, oké. Okay. Van next page? Nem, nincs, nincs, nincsen next page. Oké. Okay. Jó. Hát, uh, Sedit Adri az a helyzet, hogy ezen én pár szóma elgondolkodtam, hogy így most álmodom az egészet, és így fölébredek ilyen 20 évvel ezelőtt, hogy megint mehetek középiskolába. Jó. Na menjünk Apollo uh, srányához. Kicsit még itt kinézek, csak egy pillanatra. Oké. Okay. Hát azért, azért nem, nem rossz ez a város. Na, maradjunk annyiba. Oké, okay, valami ilyesmit magyarázott az öreg, hogy itt, uh, itt vannak olyan fél éve, és uh, hogy még senki nem követett el bűnt. Whatever are you wearing? Na, mert mit? Na jó van. Megjegyeztem. Uh, nem is erre kell jönni. Cézár, így van. Na, tényleg menjünk a Apollo srányához. Centilla, would you? Keeping an eye on things, Horatius? As always, Priestess. Any news about Centilla, Navia, or Kabash? No sign of any of them, I'm afraid. But we do have a newcomer. Strangely dressed woman. Pretty, though. On the accent, too. A traveler from a faraway land, then? Seems that way. Then let's make sure she feels welcome, shall we? Of course, Priestess. Nem illik hallgatózni egyébként, csak mondom. Oké. Okay. Na, nézzük akkor itt mi a helyzet. Jó napot. Lucrecia. Give me a moment. Sorry I'm such a mess. I just lost a patient. And a dear friend. Julia. She was a good woman. Shainalam. She was poisoned. Magnergestik. She came in here frothing at the mouth. Normally I'd treat her with resin of silphium, a rare plant which is perfect for this sort of thing. Silphium. And I knew Desius had some at his market stall, right around the corner. Desius so I ran over one. there, but he just looks at me with this evil smile and says, "That'll be a thousand denarii." There was no way I could afford that, and he knew it. Then that toad shrugs and says, Supply and demand. I guess you don't value your friend's life that highly. Anywhere else, I'd just pay a thug to steal it from his stall. But there's no way I can do that down here, with the golden rule. So all I could do is come back here and just watch her die. I kept on apologizing. And now I'll never know who poisoned her, or how they managed to do it without breaking the golden rule, or why she cursed that snake's cruel black eyes with her dying breath. 
Well, unless you have the power to bring someone back from the dead, there's really just one thing you can do. Get me that Silphium resin. I'm going to have another patient in here soon. Could be in the next day or in the next hour. And I will not allow this to happen again. I don't care how you get it, but you have to make it happen. Because if I lose another patient this way, I swear to the gods below, not even the golden rule will stop me from marching up to that genetric Fututo and scratching his eyes out. What do you mean? Oh, kaptunk egy side questet. Ja nem, opcionális, hogy elmondhatjuk, hogy őt gyanúsítjuk. Hát de Lucréciát miért gyanúsítanánk? Oké. Okay. I'm Lucretia, and I'm going to be straight with you. I'm not a physician. This is Navia's clinic. I've just been filling in ever since she disappeared. I'm tired and out of my depth and miserable all the time. But I'd rather take this on myself than let one of you lot mess it up. Oh, that nem is ő itt a gyógyító, hanem Navia csak ő nincs itt. Mert elment, vagy eltűnt, vagy nem is tudom. My husband and I moved to Rome from Caesarea. He embraced the Roman way more than I would have liked and turned into an awful philanderer. I would have divorced him and demanded the return of my dowry, but I knew he would sooner have me killed than give me my right. So I waited for the right time to take what was mine and disappear. And then the fires came. As he prepared to evacuate our villa, I gathered our most precious belongings, coins and gemstones, and the moment his back was turned, I ran. I could barely see for the smoke. And the streets were full of people trampling each other. I ran for the river, like everyone else, and leapt in. The next thing I remember, I was waking up on a riverbank, not far from here. Uh -huh. It's all right. Say what you will about this place. At least my fornicating husband will never find me. And while there's no shortage of snakes here, at least with the golden rule, they have to try to be discreet about it. Okay. Oh, because you never mind the info. Oh, this shrine was in use as a clinic long before any of us arrived here. Kind of strange to set up a clinic in the temple of the god of disease. But the god who inflicts a curse is also the only god who can undo it. So I suppose praying to Apollo for healing kind of makes sense. Mm -hmm. Well, she used to run the clinic. She was a midwife, not a physician. But she was the closest thing we had down here. And she was good too. Until she suddenly lost all interest in us. One day she told me she'd made some profound discovery about the golden statues. This changes everything, she kept saying. But I had no idea what she was talking about. The last time I saw her, the last time any of us saw her, she was muttering to the statues, like she could talk to them. And then she shut herself in the palace, barred the door from the inside, and nobody's seen her since. She's been gone so long now, we figure she's either dead or up to something so strange that she doesn't want anyone else to know about it. But I really wish I could reach her, because that's the only hope I have of solving a troubling problem, a real thorn in the poor situation. One of my patients is suffering from terrible rheumatism. His joints are inflamed and he's in constant pain. Can I homage? Uh, you'll hear them. I really shouldn't say. He wouldn't like it. And he's a little bit scary. He's become so irritable that the smallest things set him off. And I worry he'll end up losing his temper and lashing out. And you know what that means. I just know Navia would know how to treat him, assuming she's still alive. But nobody seems to know how to get into the palace. Hmm. Okay, that the palotaba is my menünk, mert oda van be. Oda zárta be magát névia? Talán. Thanks, I suppose. 
Okay. A city without sin might sound good on paper, but whoever dreamt it up didn't think it through. Maybe it was an attempt to create some kind of utopia. But snakes like Decius will always find loopholes to exploit. And what can we do about it? Absolutely nothing. In some ways we are worse off because we can't take the law into our own hands. Tehát nem nem feltétlenül örül ennek a Golden Rule-nak. Már abban az értem, hogy nem nem működik túl jól. Mi a helyzet Júliával? Megmérgezték, vagy... Tehát szándékos volt, vagy... Hát self-inflicted. Most magát megmérgezte, tehát öngyilkos lenne? Do you really want to know? I mean, if somebody poisoned her, then surely they would have broken the golden rule, and so maybe it's best we don't discuss it. Hát de tök mindegy, mert mondjuk akkor már elvileg lesújtottak volna az Istenek. Bár nem tudom, hogy hogy működik, még azt nem, nem néztük meg. Mi, mi miért? Hemlock, I believe. Hemlock? Segítsetek ki, mi az a hemlock? Volt, tud-e valami okot, amiért meg akart volna halni? Tehát, hogy esetleg öngyilkosságra utaló jel. I haven't seen her in months. She's not allowed to leave Maliolas' villa. And they are quite secretive. Nem láttuk, nem látta hónapok óta, szóval fogalma sincs. Gladly. I wish some people here need proper medical care, not the half-baked, hanging by a thread excuse for treatment I'm giving them. Just don't get sick or injured here. I'll do my best to treat you, but I'm out of my depth and dangerously short on everything you can imagine. Mm hmm. Bürök. Fotos bürök. Okay, okay. No. Well, come back if you get sick or injured. Day or night, I'll do what I can. De most mondta, hogy amúgy egy idióta, tehát fogalma sincs, hogy mit csinál itt. Na jó, mindegy. May Apollo keep you safe. Tégedet is. És ő, Julia. No items. Ova. Barbaric looking medical implements. May Apollo keep you safe. Tehát az akkori gyógyító eszközök. Hát igen, a... Ez, ez valóban nem változott az elmúlt évezredek alatt. Én gyógynövényeket továbbra is ebben. Gyógynövények. Különböző szárított, oké, okay, oké, okay, tehát gyógynövény ö, drogok gyakorlatilag. Jó. Oké. Okay. Hmm. A oh, főhatónyaga a konin. A, ah, tehát akkor uh, ideg, ideg, bén, ideg méreg. Hmm, Oké. Okay. Bénulást okoz. Jó, uh, menjünk akkor Dézius-hoz, várjatok. Vannak nyomaink. Oké, okay, tehát szélfilmot kellene Dézius-tól szerezni. Szélfium. Kémiában mindig is erős voltam. Ez a kattanás, ez nagyon jó. Jó, a palotához is el kéne néznünk. Hát, ha névia ott van. És Reumára kellene valami. Hát termálfürdőbe kéne járni, gondolom. Jó, ezt amúgy névjával kellene megbeszélnünk. Jó, hát először akkor próbáljuk meg Dézius-t megkörnyékezni. Hát 
Hello? Elfoglaltnak tűnik. Hey Virgil, how much would you want to make me a bow? For the last time, Dacius, I'm not making you a bow. But why? You know why. But how am I going to defend myself against someone else with a weapon? There are no other weapons in the city. We all went along with the magistrate's weapons ban, so it wouldn't be an issue. That's why I've got to get in first before someone else beats me to it. Uh. Hmm. Szerezzünk egy ígyat. Hát régészkén biztos érdekes lehet. Hmm. Na megpróbálok vele már, de hát most tudok. Na oh, most már tudok vele I'm Dacius. Terrible shame what happened to Yulia. But we just have to carry on, don't we? You mean how did I end up here? That is a lengthy tale. All right. Well, you see, I'm in the business of procuring rare and precious objects liberated from the enemies of Rome. Liberated. Sculptures, vases, the occasional slave, fetch a magnificent price in Roman high society, have myself a nice little shop in Rome just off the Forum, lots of foot traffic and close to the docks. Good place to be when the fires broke out. See, about seven months ago, half of Rome caught on fire. Everyone who couldn't get to an outer gate was running for the river, hoping to escape by barge. So I gathered my coins and some priceless vases into a cart and had my most loyal slave girl, pretty young thing named Acampha, push it for me. All the way down to the river, I'm elbowing for a stampede of people, turning back now and then to make sure she hasn't legged it with my valuables. But, to my surprise, we make it, and I see this barge loading up, and it's so full it's almost sinking. But the captain's happy to take my coin, so I start boarding, and then he puts his hand on my chest and he says, No, too heavy. The cart or the girl. So I did what anyone would have done. <laughs> Of course I chose the car. I mean, I can always buy a new slave girl if I still have my money. So I put me hand on the car, and I guess you realize what was happening because those pretty black eyes of hers go all wide. And in one swift motion, she topples the whole bloody thing into the Tiber. Naturally, I dived in after it, hoping to salvage my fortune. Only, I guess I must have hit my head or something because everything went black. When I came to, I'd washed up on the riverbank, not far from here, with nothing in the world but a single silver coin. That ő is a a folyón keresztül ért ide. Thank you, friend. But it turns out it might have been a stroke of good fortune because this place is a veritable treasure trove. Look around you; there must be more gold in here than in the treasury of Rome. If I can just figure out how to get it out of here. Terrible for inflation is what it is. There's so much gold just lying around, it's practically worthless. At least down here. Of course, I have an idea for generating real wealth, but what I need is a bow. Just a simple composite bow. I've scoured this city from top to bottom with no luck. But if you happen to find one, bring it to me and we'll talk. Hmm. Oh, well, technically yes, but... That just means you'll need to be a little discreet. Thank you, friend. Um, szerintem szerzünk egy uh, íjat, és elbotoljuk a csészek óróra. Nevermind. Uh, itt, hogy a szélfilm az csészek óró. Hát a rezim meg gondolom ilyen szárított uh, maradvány, a virágzat, vagy valamelyik, valamelyik része. Mondjuk csészek óró, erről a növényről még nem is hallottam, pedig... Rezin az gyanta? Lehet? Akkor csészek óró gyanta? Fú... Oké... I'm afraid not. If you're desperate, I did hear that Aurelia down at the tavern claims to know of a way out, but... I'm not sure I trust her. Aurelia tud egy kiutat. Ah, oké. Oké. Kira fog szavazni. I mean, Sentius couldn't even keep his daughter safe. What hope does he ever protecting us? Hmm. 
Certainly. Okay. Egyelőre még azt nem mondjuk, hogy szilfium kellene nekünk. Okay, akkor a rezin az gyanta jó jó. Csészek úrú gyanta. Very well. Okay. Another time. Jó. Jó, és hol szerezzünk? Hol van az a fickó, aki az előbb itt? Sometimes I stare at the great temple on the bluff, and I think... Whatever is in there, it has to be important. Oda figyelj, mert rávitsz az ujjadra. Ah, a new face. Salve, and welcome to a little community. My name's impossible to pronounce for most people, so you can just call me Virgil. You arrived on a sad day, friend. What with Julia's death? I wish we could have met under better circumstances. Well, I'm an architect. Epitis. Or at least I was back in Rome. That's probably too grandiose a term to describe what I do here. Help out with repairs and try to stop old buildings from collapsing on people. That kind of thing. But you probably don't want to hear about the ingenious architecture or mysterious history of this place. Hat er heute nicht? Oh, I'm glad you asked. Some of these shrines were constructed hundreds of years ago, which means Romans have been arriving here for at least that long. But there's one thing that puzzles me: the oldest shrine in this avenue isn't Roman at all. It's Greek. Hmm. Hát, ezt nem tudom. Well, yes, that could be the reason. Or it could mean that there were Greeks living and worshipping here before the Romans arrived. Which begs the interesting question, who really built this place? And could it be far older than any of us imagine? If only there was a way we could talk to the people who came here before us. The stories they could tell. Hmm. Tehát vannak ilyen nagyon régi részek is ebbe a városba. Ennek a fickónak meg mintha német akcentusa lenne. Na mindegy. Lehet, hogy sváb. Gladly. Personally, my favorite thing about this place is the aqueducts. Those series of adjoining arches. They're an ingenious feat of Roman engineering, with a very practical purpose. They take fresh water coming from outside the city and distribute it all across the castle. It's funneled below the palace and into a cistern beneath the great temple. Some of it flows down into another cistern beneath the villas, and the rest is funneled to the shrine of Proserpina, where it fills the lake and allows us to fish and farm. Igen, azok a csővezetékek, amikbe egyébként ólom volt, és hát a, a rómaiak tudatára nem volt jó hatás, ha maradjunk annyiba. Hey, not so loud! Just talking about that could anger the gods for all we know. I'm not saying it's impossible, but you'd have to find a way inside somehow. Just, please, try to be a bit more discreet about it. You mean the great temple? This one's a bit of a mystery. Given the way it's positioned so prominently, looking down on us, it's clear that whoever built it felt it was the most important temple in the city. Unfortunately, someone else went out of their way to keep its purpose a mystery. You see, usually a temple is dedicated to a particular god, like Proserpina or Diana or Apollo. Usually, that god is obvious. But in this case, it's unknown. There's an obelisk out the front, which probably used to bear the name of this unknown god. But it appears 
Some barbarian defaced it. And of course we can't get inside because it's locked up tighter than the Temple of Saturn in Rome. And that contains the treasury. So we're all left wondering, which god is that temple dedicated to? And could it be the one responsible for the Golden Rule? Unless somebody figures out a way inside, I suppose we'll never know. Hmm. Of course. Some people say it's divine, the work of a god, but I'm not so sure. It just seems so flawed to me, like it's distinctly human. I mean, once you've been here long enough, you notice people doing things that just seem so wrong to you. But this so-called god doesn't seem to care, which means one of two things. Either you don't know the difference between right and wrong, or this unknown god doesn't. And I'm pretty sure I know the difference. Do you? Good. Then I hope you'll agree that there are only two ways of dealing with unfair rulers. The first is to leave. The second is to remove the ruler from power. And it seems leaving may not be an option. Good question. It's best if I say no more, but I hope you'll give it some thought. Mm -hmm. Okay. In graffiti, Isra Shavatam. Oh, it means someone thinks I'm a sinner and that I'm going to break the golden rule. Look, I haven't done anything wrong, if that's what you're thinking. Somebody just has a problem with my preference for male company. Oh. And when you grow up in the north, as I did, in the city of Novio Magus, you expect a bit of hostility. The Batavi are not known for their tolerance. I saw enough friends killed or driven away to know the cost of not keeping your personal affairs to yourself. So I hid who I was for... what was it? Nearly ten years? Watching what I said and where I looked. But that kind of fear eats away at you slowly, until living isn't any better than the thing you were afraid of. Needless to say, since I'm now living underground, halfway across the known world with an assumed name, my openness didn't go down well among the enlightened folk of the Batavi. Hmm. In any case, the Romans are far more accepting, and among them, I get to be who I am. Or at least, I thought that was the case. It seems I was wrong. Uh, it's not just graffiti. I have quite the collection of handwritten notes too. The strange thing is, I keep my personal affairs to myself. I've never really been interested in any of the men here. Not my type. So I'm not sure what I could have done to upset this person. If I had to guess, I'd say it's probably one of those cultists. Cultist. Strange bunch. They insist there's only one God, and that he considers my nature a sin. Can you believe that? If there are any of them here, they won't admit it. Not since they supposedly burned down half of Rome last year and went into hiding. All I know is, if these threats keep escalating, eventually my secret admirer is going to cross a line and break the golden rule. Oké, tehát valószínű akkor azok a keresztények lehetnek, akik Rómát is fölégették. És valaki van itt közülük, ezek a kultiszt. <gül> Igen, vagy politikus. What? Really? I... I didn't expect that. But thanks. It's always a pleasure to meet someone so selfless. I'm glad you arrived when you did. I'd start by figuring out who the cultists are. Or maybe ask around among the merchants here. Someone who lives or works in the forum must have seen something. But if you find them, please don't hurt or humiliate them. I suspect they're just confused. Okay. You wouldn't believe how often the new ones ask that question. But I tell you the same thing I tell everyone else. There are much worse places to live out your days. 
You might have a few sleepless nights thinking about the golden rule. But once you get used to the fear, knowing that a single slip-up could cost you everything, it's not too bad. Nothing new to me, anyway. Oh, I just mean I grew up in the Batavi tribe, far to the north in Novio Magus, and learned to expect a bit of hostility. They weren't nearly as tolerant as the Romans. Okay. Well, Maliolis is talking about loosening some of the restrictions in this place. And while it's all a bit vague, at least he has a vision. Mm -hmm. My vote isn't for sale, if that's what you're asking. Nice to talk to you. Uh, okay. Itt vannak a levelek, amit kapott. For your, for your sins. Tehát valaki olyasmit keresünk, aki szerint uh, az, amilyen Virgil, az bűn. Hát igen. Egy római lapát, ami bronzból készül. Hamuszaga van. Oké. Sometimes I stare at the great temple on the bluff, and I think, whatever is in there, it has to be important. Oké. Jó. Hát akkor. Őnek is egy, jövünk egy szívességgel, mégpedig azzal, hogy, hogy kiderítjük, hogy kizaklatja. Aztán majd mi is kérünk cserébe valamit. Na, mit kéne csinálnunk? Hát, obtain a bow. Szerintem majd az lesz, hogy Megpróbáljuk kideríteni, hogy kizaklatja, bár szerintem az egy későbbi dolog lesz, és akkor talán szerzünk íjat. Vagy kérünk tőle cserébe egy íjat. Hát szerintem ez most még nem olyan érdekes. Hm. Jó, ezt most lehet trekkelni. Talán. Esetleg még a... Jaj. Nem. Ezt find a way into the palace. Jó, hát ez a kettő van, amivel most tudunk foglalkozni. Hát próbáljunk meg itt beszélni a többiekkel. Greetings and salutations. Jó napot! Greetings, I'm Georgius. It gladdens me to see another foreigner in our midst. We must stick together, you and I. And I must say, my sartorial friend, your clothing is most extraordinary. Leather boots in place of sandals, trousers with precise stitching, and such a curious design. I have traveled distant trade routes from the markets of Damascus to the farms of India, and never have I seen anyone dressed quite like you. Tell me, I must know. From which exotic part of the world do you hail? Debrecen. Then you are an explorer like me. Wonderful. You must have many stories to share. I cannot wait to hear them. We will have much time here to get to know one another. But for now. Do you require assistance? I know you do not require clothing, so information perhaps? Information, Kena. This is troubling, is it not? I'm afraid I have no idea. It is ridiculous though, Virgil is a fine man. But my young friend Fabia confided in me that she saw someone leaving graffiti on his shop front last night. Perhaps you should ask her about it. Fabia? Tehát 
Ő, Fábia látott valakit. Látta, hogy ki e, írta a grafitit. Vagy ki rajzolta föl, írta? My story? How kind of you to ask? I am a tailor and I run the humble shop in the forum. You mean to say, with all the turmoil and terror of the golden rule and so few customers, why bother setting shop at all? I'll tell you, it is precisely because of the golden rule that I wish to remind my friends of the importance of looking one's best. I say, the more of our customs we preserve down here, the more we can preserve a semblance of normality, the better our chances of keeping our head. Don't you agree? Igen, meg hát olyan olasznak hangzik a fickó. Tehát most milyen boltot nyisson? Hát vagy ruhaboltot nyit, vagy fagyizót, érted? Hát most mit? Vagy pizzériát, ugye? Oh, and there is another reason too. If we all end up as golden statues for future generations to marvel at, I don't know about you, but I would like to look my best. <laughs> Ennyi, ez már tudja, hogy olasz. A good question, a very good question indeed, and I would be happy to tell you if only I could remember it clearly myself. Ő is emlékszik, hogy hogy került ide? Hmm, I remember I had just been to Rome to sell an extraordinary selection of wares, and drowning in coin, I decided to celebrate my success. That Berugot? I rented a prestigious villa by the Tiber, invited over a few select friends. And we began making our way through some of the most exquisite wine money could buy. Quite a lot of it, in fact. Now, I have had visions and awoken in strange places before. I have even found myself naked in the desert sands more than once, but none of that compares to this. This time, I remember people screaming, then falling into a void as empty as time before creation, gasping for air, and then nothing. When I regained my faculties, I was lying naked by the banks of the Tiber, God knows how many miles from my villa. Oh, that the Tiber and hat again. Saying that was a huge error, no, because I overdid them. Was that then? Indeed, I'm lucky I was carrying a little extra weight. I believe it kept me afloat. In any case, it seems I'd been rescued and resuscitated by a benevolent stranger. I went to find firewood for his campfire, stumbled across a cave, and discovered that trapdoor temple. And here I am. Oh, that őt is azon a nő irányította akkor ide? Ezek szerint, vagy valaki ide irányította? Not so loud. What are you playing at? Have you not been told about the last attempt? Oh, well, I can't prove it. Makes sense. This duty falls to me. Ah, it is a long story. Aha, you are witty. I like that. Of course, the first question any of us asks when we first arrive is, how do I escape? It is only natural, after all. And scaling the chasm wall is out of the question, for it is simply too steep and too far. But as they say, if the wind fails, use the oars. And here the second option is to leave the way we came in, through the shaft above the bathhouse. See, the shaft is quite high, but if one gathered up enough wood, one could make a series of ladders and climb one's way out. Mm-hmm, okay. They have. I am getting to that. There was an attempt made by resourceful fellows who lived here some years ago. They even decided to keep records of their escape attempt for posterity. Unfortunately, as soon as they began to carry the first ladder down the hallway, they heard a godlike voice shake the entire city, and that, tragically, is where their tale ends. So it seems that to merely attempt escape is to invite the wrath of whichever god oversees this place. And so I say, it is best to not even discuss it aloud. Okay, I understand. That any of them don't want to talk about it because they don't want the gods to see it, and then they will punish them. I understand. 
A Tevere folyó, oké, oké. A Tiberis. Uh-huh. Közép-Olaszország legjelentősebb folyója. Értem. Hát gondolom akkor Rómán átfolyik. Feltételezem. Ah, yes. The man is held suffer for the sins of the one. As a Greek, this is nothing new to me. It is how our gods operate. Have you not heard the tale of the god Hades? Hades. He was the first to learn this dreadful lesson when he abducted Persephone and imprisoned her in the underworld. When Demeter, the mother of Persephone, learned of this, she did not punish Hades, the guilty one. Instead, she changed the climate of Earth so that it became hot and dry. Nothing grew. The grain turned to empty husks and the rivers dried up. Innocent people died by the tens of thousands until at last the other gods were forced to act lest they have no worshippers left. So yes, we know this rule. This has always been the case. The golden rule has merely brought it into focus. If we are to survive, I say we must each keep the simple wisdom of Thales of Miletus, first of the seven sages of Greece, who said, Avoid doing what you would blame others for doing. Hát ez a csak azt tedd meg embertársaid, de amint magadon is elviselni a körülbelül. Igen. Does, doesn't it? But it is not enough for us to do this alone. For even if 99% of us adopt this principle, that will never be enough. Sadly, no matter how well we protect ourselves, the life's work of many good people can be undone in the blink of an eye by a single selfish act. Mm-hmm. Ah, the voice of experience. I am sorry for your loss, my friend. But on a lighter note, I will say one thing for the golden rule. For all their grim and haunting poses, these golden statues do make magnificent models for my clothing. Do they not? That's quite chic, then. Okay, kira fog szavazni. Tudod kira szavazol. I would not enjoy the thought of another visit from Domitius if I voted the wrong way. Okay. De miért kéne megváltoztatnunk ezt? Nem értem. But of course. I hope that our paths cross again soon, my friend. My friend. Thank you, my friend. És amúgy... Lehet vennék valami nadrágot. Vagy azt itt nőnek nem lehet. Mondjuk, hogy látom másnak se. De mindegy. You look well, my sartorial friend. Köszönöm. Oké, okay. na hát euh, meg kéne keresnünk akkor ezt a fábiát. Um, olyan furcsa, hogy nem látom fábiát. Highlighted quest. Um, Don't you just love springtime? Uh, mit mondod, hogy hol van Fábia? Oh, a fenéje meg. Nincsen. Ah, nincs. Uh, tudom választ, változtatni ezt. Uh, Oké. Okay. Uh, valahol itt lehet? Oh. The Matrix. Már hogy értve? A 
まずはバイオに Egyik fél terneve volt a... Nem tudom... Hogy hol van Fábia. Vagy azt majd úgy meg kell találnunk menet közben. Na mindegy, akkor lehet, hogy nézzünk egy másik questet addig. Hát, ezt majd akkor, amikor megvan a bó. Hát talán akkor ezt néviát megpróbáljuk kivenni a... Menj, mert ennyi kamerre szeretnék, oké, okay, oké, okay, oké. Okay. Um... Jó, hát megpróbálunk fölmenni oda a... Hát... Mondjuk... Lehet, hogy... Na mindegy, jöjjünk erre akkor. Közben meg nézelődünk. Hát... Azért jobban néz ki. Azt kell, hogy mondjam. Már úgy, úgy szép a hely. Megyek össze-vissza. Na mindegy. De megértem, hogy pont rám néz. <gül> Jó, na menjünk. Igen, Sedi Tadri végül is engedélyt adott, hogy bemehessek mindenhova. Mondjuk mondta azt is, hogy... hogy kivéve, hogyha megkérik, hogy távozzak. Ho -ho. A, és a... A, a, a suttogás segít. Note from Navia. Ó, oh, akkor itt van Navia. Oké okay, is. És nem tudunk bemenni. De nem lehet, hogy ki akar jönni. Ja, igen, azt mondták is, hogy be van zárva. Végül is, ha találtuk, az nem lopás, nem? Testvéreim. Jó. Valami ilyesmit erős, mert emlékszem, hogy keresed, keresnünk kéne egy másik bejáratot. Hát gondolom, hogy nem lehet felugrálni, mert ez nem a Dying Light. Úgyhogy... Öm... Már szelesebb az idő. Ez egy vad dénár. Oké. Nem emlékszem, hogy ezek. Mert tő, láttam több. Ö, több ö, ilyen aranyszobrot is, hogy ők miért ö, váltak már most aranyszoborra, de na mindegy. A Nevermind az mondjuk kemény lenne, az vagány lenne. Jövök. 
Ez a híd alatt, aha. Ja, igen, itt, itt uh, van ez a víz, uh, vízvezetékrendszer, amin lehet, hogy ki lehet jutni. Azt mondja, keresünk egy kreatív utat. Hát ez nagyon kreatív lesz. Föl se tudok itt jönni. Nem. Majd fölmegyünk a lépcsőn. Gondolom, ott föl lehet menni. Ja. Hey! Hmm. Nagyon sietős volt. Ja, és akkor most itt vagyunk fönt már a... to you good citizens uh, and now and now and now i make this solemn promise to you good citizens um i when you can put load on leap into my villa from the balcony a hundred feet above that was either extremely reckless or impressively clever well why have you risked life and limb to see me Oh, ez a másik miniszterelnök jelölt. Én köszönöm, hogy megkérdezted. 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 Én köszönöm, It's a children's fable exploited by Sentius to frighten us into submission. Did the Queen change? Don't tell me you've fallen victim to that monstrous lie. Hát amúgy láttuk, hogy hogy igen csak az. The person making a claim bears the onus of proving that claim. Can you do that? Can you prove the golden moon is real? Why? What credible evidence do you have for its existence? Oh, I should be careful now. I'd better be saying it, Jim. Hát igen, mondjuk ebbe is van, hogy ha nem is tudom bebizonyítani, elfogadni miért ne lenne. Jó dolog. Ha, ha nincs igazam, akkor jobb lesz tőle a város, és ennyi. I disagree. I'll be guided by what is best for the city's people, and that means giving them the freedom to do as they wish. Ah, de az veszélyes, tehát hogy do as they wish, az az. Surely you're not one of those people who believes everything you read. As if a lie could be transformed into the truth by the simple act of writing it down. True, but that is simply because you are mistaken. Yo, hát az már tudjuk mit gondol Goldenról, so what? You mean the children's fable exploited by Sentius to scare us all into doing what he wants? I trust you can see yourself out through the door this time. There's a key just beside it. The key was this. Ah, Fitzgoit. 
ennek a fickónak a medencéjében. Thank you. I am delighted and deeply honored to have been elected your magistrate. Magistrate. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. I'm delighted and deeply honored. Let us take a look. And now, and now, I make this solemn promise to you, good citizens. And now, and now, and now, I make this solemn promise to you, good citizens. Um, under my leadership, you will finally enjoy the freedom you deserve. And yes, not from you, Leo. No more shall you walk on, walk on. Well, eggshells, yes, 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 yes. No more shall you walk on. A suicide note. Fearing simply to live and breathe because the tyrant Sintius told you it was forbidden. Yes. My first act. My first act as magistrate. Okay, tehát akkor kiderült, hogy öngyilkos lett alapvetően, mert hogy még az is jó, mint hogy a melelosszal, vagy hogy hogy hívják, Captors, akkor ők a, de most akkor Julia az ő rabszolgájuk volt tulajdonképpen. Mert hagyott itt egy jó kívánságot, hogy... hogy na mindegy. Hm. Érdekes, akkor ezek szerint tényleg a Júlia az öngyilkos lett. És itt van a... Na már el is felejtettem. Na mindegy, a méreg. Bürök, azaz. Oké. Hát, igen, ez szomorú. Nagyon szomorú. De legalább információ. Oké, és a rózsaszín répa? Vagy lila? Igen. Még mielőtt kinemesítették ezt a sárgát. Ilyen, ilyen lila volt. Ah, igen, hát szellőzés nélkül kellett itt a tűzön, de hát nyilván a, úgymond a, ezek a tulajdonosok nem nagyon foglalkoztak azzal, hogy uh, ugye a rabszolgák, vagy hát szolgák milyen körülmények között uh, dolgoznak. Oké, okay. jó. Valószínűleg az élet ingyilkos Júlia is, mert hát... Nem volt, nem volt jó sora. Oké, okay. tintatartó. Oké. Okay. Jó, hát itt föl lehet menni, de még itt megnézzük, hogy lehet mi van. Uh, Hát egy ilyen udvarnak az én is tudnék körülni, bár kicsit sok a, a beton, de ennyi baj legyen. Jó, és akkor itt más nincs. Várjátok még az udv... Ez viszont görög, azt írja. Meg ő is. Oké... És akkor ide ki lehet feküdni, sziasztázni. Hát jó. Oké. Jó, itt semmi nincs. És akkor itt még fölmegyünk, hogy itt mi van. Azt hittem a szobor volt. Hát valaki így szomorú, de nem tudunk bemenni hozzá. 
Hát úgy tűnik, hogy itt csak körbe lehet jönni. Igen. Jó, tehát ott volt valaki, aki nagyon el volt keseredve valami miatt. Jó, és ez is záró van. Így van. De akkor hogy megyünk ki innen? <gül> Igen, nevermind, ez, ez jogos. Kösz a tippet. Igen, a kulcsa ki lehet nyitni a, az árakat általában. Jó. Na és akkor itt van uh, Melilus, vagy hogy hívják, és mi onnan ugrottunk be egy uh, kis látogatásra. Uh, viszont azt megnézhettük volna, hogy miért, fut, miért futott el a nő. Te ilyen kidobó vagy? What were you two talking about? Don't play dumb. I saw you. Having a shady little chat with old man Sentius up on his balcony. If he's making a last ditch effort to pick up votes by talking to a woman, he's even more senile than I thought. Everyone knows women can't vote. What else would you be murmuring about on election day? Mark my words, Maliolus is going to be magistrate by the end of the day. And if I tell him you've sided with that feeble old has-been, that you've been trying to undermine his hard-won victory, you'll have picked the wrong patron. Got it? Good, then stay out of it. Nobody likes Caput Murday foreigners interfering in an election. Caput Murday. Ah, Connor. The name's Domitius. You want to get to Maliolus? You go through me. But Kellett Londoni. Why? Because I am a gladiator. That's why. Oh. You want to see me fight? Keep running your mouth, fatuous cunners. I think it's gone on long enough, and Maliolus is going to put an end to it once he's elected. Mm -hmm. He's going to announce it in his victory speech. Just you wait and see. Old man said she's got you already, did he? Well, I'm not talking to people in his faction. Comfort you, are I? Yo, dumátunk. Um, igen, ez is ismerős. Hey, you're not thinking about going into the cistern, are you? Good. You be eaten alive, little runt like you. Nobody's told you about Hannibal. Hannibal. Why do I have to do everything around here? So, there was this guy called Hannibal, right? Funny accent. Used to go down into the cisterns looking for junk he could clean up and sell. One day, a few weeks back, he comes out and tells me the cisterns are haunted. Said he could hear spirits wailing. Of course, nobody believed him, because who trusts a Carthaginian, right? Anyway, a few days later, he goes back in. And hours go by. And he hasn't come back out, yeah? So I go down after him, and it's dark. But in the distance, I can just make out his body, sprawled out on the ground, and hunched over him was something that made my blood run cold. No word of a lie. I saw a creature. Like the corpse of a man who'd been flayed. And it was eating Hannibal. 
What any sane person would have done. I legged it out of there and put a sign at the door to warn the others. Good idea. Mm -hmm. Oké, okay, akkor majd később megyünk oda le. Itt mi van? Átlopni az így csak neve. Mert mint hogy... Eddig is loptunk alapvetően, de... Azért ne ilyen nyilvánvalóan. Valakinek segítségre van szüksége. Octavia. Akkor hát, ha, ha itt van Octavia, akkor itt lesz való Fábia is a közelbe. Reménykedni tudok. De lehet, hogy Octavia nincs itthon. Nem nincs itthon. Oké. Okay. Két ajtaja van a háznak. Az nagyon komoly. És így sincs, oké. Okay. Hát itt nincs senki. Na, merre menjünk tovább? You look well, my sartorial friend. Gorgeous. Ugye arról jöttünk... Hát... Megnézek, fölnézek erre. Bár szerintem itt... Hm. Igen, ide, ide adunk ki ugyanúgy. Hm. Na, mindjárt kitalálom, hogy merre menjünk tovább, csak hozok. Hozok teát. Is vagyok. Mm, tükröt. A medúzát. Uh -huh. Jó, majd valonnan intézek. Hát, itt még Körülnézhetünk esetleg. Ez zárva van. <gül> My eyes are up here, igen. Ez a hát kvázi kórház, ugye Apollóval. Uh, itt a pékség. Really available to anyone who wants it. De csak egyet viszünk, mert nem vagyunk mohók. Roman recipe for bread. Na. Hát 
Hát igen, ez ilyen nagyon klasszik, amihez csak liszt kell, meg víz, meg só. Végségből lehet hozni kenyeret. Ez itt micsoda. Nincs kiírva. Hm. Household Shrine. Egy hely. Nem tudom, srány, mindig elfelejtem, hogy mi a srány magyarul. Szenté, köszönöm, igen. Minerva szobra, a, stratégiai ró a stratégia római istene. Bevásárló lista. Things to buy once I've escaped. Things to buy. Seat on the Senate. Ez Dézius-nak a listája, hogyha megszökik. Aha. Hát oké. Okay. Hmm. Az ő ládájában van zárva. <coughs> Bocsánat. Választás. Ja, lehet azért nincs itt, mert elment, elment, a, elment szavazni. De hol lehet szavazni? in the baths. Real nasty sort, with his face all covered up, and he's got a weapon. You have to do something, or he's gonna break the golden rule. <laughs> None of us do. The magistrate made us throw them all into the chasm. So now this man's bow is the only one in the city. You'll just have to improvise. Ó, oh, tehát van egy uh, íja. Thank you. He's still in there somewhere. I have to hide. Find me in this empty shrine when it's over. Here what? What? We don't have time for this. I have to go. Mit csináljak a, a flashlight-tal? Vágjam vele fejbe? Oh shit. Stop right there. I am looking for Tiberius Quintius Crispus, otherwise known as 
Quintius. Do you know where he is? Uh, all right, Latam. I'm not sure I believe that, so allow me to explain something to you. I am here with orders from Emperor Nero himself to find and execute the cultist Quintius for terrible crimes against the Empire. That Quintius. So, if you tell me the truth, I will allow you to live. But if you lie to me or otherwise obstruct the Emperor's business in any way, I will put this arrow through your chest. Is that understood? Thank you. Now tell me, who are you people, and what is this place? The many shall suffer I was told for the sins of the one. But I never thought he'd be foolish enough to lead me right to the heart of his mystery cult. Oh, don't play coy with me. I don't care if you're worshipping Bacchus, Magna Mater, or Christ. You lot are all the same to me. Always sneaking off to your secret sanctuaries, indoctrinating each other with your little mantras. The Emperor may have tolerated your activities up until now, but after what Quintius did, those days are numbered. You say that, but if you're not a cult, then why go to such great lengths to keep this place a secret? So you admit you're not allowed to leave. That sounds an awful lot like a cult to me. And I saw the inscription saying, the many shall suffer for the sins of the one. I take it this is some kind of mantra you all believe? Uh, a distinction without a difference. You've clearly been indoctrinated into this Had nonsense. The, no, there. Now tell me, where did you lot get enough gold to make all these statues? Had again? You lot are practicing human sacrifice too. You people disgust me. Igen, tehát most kicsavarod, hogy mit yes, mondok. Yes, because I'm the real villain here. It's all clear to me now. The secret sanctuary, the indoctrination, the mantra, the human sacrifice. Your cultists. There's no doubt in my mind. És akkor most mi lesz? Is how a person can believe in something with such a zeal. They just can't see what they've become. However, you still have a chance to redeem yourself by telling me where Quintius is. Do not waste it. Very well, here's what I know. He's a 40 to 50 year old man with distinctive eyes, one green and one blue. He's also known to have delusions of grandeur. The Emperor says he and his cult, your cult, are responsible for starting the fire which burnt half of Rome to the ground and killed thousands in the process. Okay, that's akkor ő a, a cultist, a, <laughs> az ellenzék miniszterelnök jelöltje, úgymond. Who are you to challenge what the Emperor says? Were you there? Do you have spies and scouts all over Rome, like he does? No, you do. Nem, de történész vagyok, szóval. This is your last chance. Are you going to tell me where he is or not? Ah, suddenly it's all coming back to you, is it? Thank you. For your service to the Empire, I'll let you live for now, but you'd best make sure our paths don't cross again. Menj már! Um. I don't want to go to Tartus! 
They're turning us to gold. Photon. Lehet, hogy nem is erre kell jönni a múlj. Hűha. Um, hát nem. Van baj. Meghaltunk. Öm. Ja, és akkor innen folytatjuk most. Ja, mert... Oké, okay. közben stop soros. köszönöm szépen a száz bitet. The man shall suffer for the sins of one. Igen, hát valószínű ez történt. Salve, friend. Hogy mi? Ez megint szalad valahova. Oké. You have to do something. A man arrived in the baths. Mondhattam volna mást. Igen, mondhattam volna, hogy ne ott találkozunk, hanem máshol, mert hogy... Pontosan tudom, hogy mit kellett volna csinálnom. I am looking for Tiberius Quinctius Crispus, otherwise known as Quinctius. Do you know where he is? I'm not sure I believe that, so allow me to explain something to you. I am here with orders from Emperor Nero himself to find and execute the cultist Quinctius for terrible crimes against the Empire. So, if you tell me the truth, I will allow you to live. But if you lie to me, or otherwise obstruct the Emperor's business in any way, I will put this arrow through your chest. Is that understood? Thank you. Now tell me, who are you people, and what is this place? Oh, how very welcoming of you. you the many shall suffer for the sins of the one. I was told Quintius was a cultist, but I never thought he'd be foolish enough to lead me right to the heart of his mission. Um. Most köszönöm újra a százast. Um, you 
have to do something. A man arrived in the baths. Real nasty sort, with his face all covered up. And he's got a weapon. You have to do something, or he's gonna break the golden rule. Fabia, but now's not the time. Are you going to help or not? Okay. Thank you. He's still in there, somewhere. I have to hide. Find me in this empty shrine when it's over. Oh, és azért segít, mert... What? We don't have time for this. I have to go. Never mind. Fábia. De rá szükségem lenne még amúgy. Azt mondja, hogy most nincs erre időnk. Jó van, bazd meg, akkor menj. Bocsánat. Stop right there. I am looking for Tiberius Quinctius Crispus, otherwise known as Quinctius. Do you know where he is? I'm not sure I believe that, so allow me to explain something to you. I am here with orders from Emperor Nero himself to find and execute the cultist Quinctius for terrible crimes against the Empire. So, if you tell me the truth, I will allow you to live. But if you lie to me, or otherwise obstruct the Emperor's business in any way, I will put this arrow through your chest. Jó, oké, okay, értem. Thank you. Now tell me, who are you people, and what is this place? A small community. <laughs> I was told Quinctius was a cultist, but I never thought he'd be foolish enough to lead me right to the heart of his mystery cult. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. You say that, but if you're not a cult, then why go to such great lengths to keep... De nem tudok semmit csinálni. Um, de mindjárt kitalálom, hogy mi lesz csak... Igen, valami... Állaki timing, igen, igen, igen. Valószínű nem a párbeszéd. Tehát az a baj, hogy a párbeszéd közben um, triggel erődik ez a um, The Many Shall Suffer for the Sins of One. <laughs> És topsoros köszönöm még egyszer a százast. You serious? This is an emergency. Are you going to help or not? Are you daft or just callous? If you don't stop him, we're all going to die. Yes. Oh, Shady Tadri. Köszönöm az ötöst. Köszi. The shrine is collapsing. 
Igen, az lesz Nevermind. Nem bírja a potato PC a gép, a gémet. Mindegy, addig itt körülnézünk. Ó! Oh. Ki vagy? Uh, Megint bementem hello? egy pár beszédbe. Bye bye. I did not do it, Dully. Hmm. Jön a fickó amúgy. De lehet, hogy a... Ha? Micsoda? De hol van? Beszélgetnek. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Run, follow Sanchez back to the shrine and use his portal again. Okay. Na most tegyek fel, menjünk akkor a portálhoz. Egyik lehet, hogy nem erre kéne jönni, mert erre múltkor is nagyot estünk, bár mondjuk... Oké... Okay. Már lőnek. Jó, és akkor most bemegyünk ide a portába megint. <gül> Stopsoros, köszönöm még egyszer a százast. Köszi. Oké. Okay. És akkor most előről az egészet. Jó, tehát hogyha ha történik ez a... ez a dolog, akkor szaladni kell ide. Mindent értek. Uh, salve, friend. I'm Galerius. Mind telling me who you are and what you were doing in the Shrine of Proserpina? Uh, I don't think so. I've never seen you before in my life. Oh, I guess how much did I drink last night? Uh, sorry to have bothered you. Oh, and since you seem to be in a hurry, you should try out this device I made. Worked real hard on it. Device. Mian device. Zipline handlebar. De ez csak így random oda adja egy idegennek. Tessék, itt van ezzel tudsz ilyen ziplinon végigmenni. Kösz! Just attach the pulley to the rope over the lake and hang on to the handles. If it works, it'll be faster than walking. And if it doesn't work, The worst thing that can happen is you'll take a swim in the lake. I haven't quite summoned the courage to test it myself. But don't worry, it's completely safe. Probably. All right, see you around. Mm hmm. Okay. Then I could. It took you quite a while. Hát jó. Jó, oké, okay, akkor azt hiszem, hogy értem, hogy mi történik. Tehát akkor meg kell akadályoznunk, hogy valami bűn kövessenek el. 
mert különben akkor triggel erődik ez a, ez a dolog. Na, akkor... Uh, <hums> meg kéne keresnünk... Hát, mondjuk mindegy, mit csinálunk alapvetően. Jó. Um, na, rát nem érti. Hát... Nagyjából értem, maradjunk annyiba. Tehát meg kell akadályoznunk a bűnt, ami a, a Gold Errolt triggereli, végül is. Vagy hát megszegi ezt a Gold Errolt, na. És akkor nem kell a portál, de nem jó. Jó, találjuk ki azt, hogy uh, tehát ki kell derítenünk, hogy mi az, ami nagy valószínűséggel majd megszegi ezt a Golden Rule-t, és szóljunk Sanchez-nek. Jó, és akkor itt vannak ugye, amit még tudunk csinálni. Jó. A bow might come in useful. Hát, igen. Igen, akkor fábjával kéne... Skyrim módként indult? Ó, oh. hát még jó, hogy standalone játék lett. Fú, Sedit Adri Skyrim. Hát, én nobody got time for that. But, hát, de mondjuk, hogyha azt szeretnéd, persze mehet csak. Egyre több, egyre több dolog van, amit tudunk csinálni. Hát Fábiát kéne megkeresni valahogy. Például, mondjuk, lehet, hogy a fürdőbe lesz egyébként, mert onnan menekült ki talán. Nem, itt van. Help! You have to do something. A man arrived in the baths. A real nasty sort, with his face all covered up, and he's got a weapon. You have to do something, or he's going to break the golden rule. Fabia, but now's not the time. Are you going to help or not? None of us do. The magistrate made us throw them all into the chasm. So now this man's bow is the only one in the city. You'll just have to improvise. Thank you. He's still in there, somewhere. I have to hide. Find me in this empty shrine when it's over. What? Why? Uh, all right, um, fine. Come and find me in my bakery instead. Please be careful. Okay, I'll go next to my bakery, yeah. It's all up to you. Nice, nice. 
Pamia. Did you stop him? What are you waiting for? Stop right there. I am looking for Tiberius Quinctius Crispus, otherwise known as Quinctius. Do you know where he is? Hmm. Thank you. For your service to the Empire, I'll let you live for now. But you'd best make sure our paths don't cross again. Nem, a lámpa nem hat. Um. Hát nem tudom, hogy mit csinálhatnék vele, amúgy. Hey Virgil, how much would you want to make me a bow? For the last time, Dacis, I'm not making you a bow. Na, és ezt most már meg tudjuk mutatni majd uh, Sanchez-nek, hogy... Uh, igen. Hogy ő lehet a... a... a kultiszt. Mondjuk nem Sanchez itt a lényeg, hanem... Na mindegy. Igen. Dénár. Kérdezzük meg Melalost, hogy ő e Quin... Quin... Quinticus. Igen. Más nincs itt nála. Oké. Okay. Jó. Uh, Shadit Adri részben... Uh, de szerintem... Olvas egy kicsit utána, mert én erről nem nagyon beszélhetek. I'm sorry to trouble you, but I couldn't help but notice that fine bow you're carrying. No idea how you managed to get your hands on it, especially in the light of our dear old magistrate's ban. But I'm impressed. And before you ask, no, I wouldn't dream of trying to buy it from you. I have no use for a wooden bow myself. But I would like to propose a joint business venture of sorts. Tell me, do you have any idea how people here end up as golden statues? And here I was thinking I was the only one to figure it out. In any case, supposedly one or two of those arrows is enough to turn a full-grown man into gold. Now, of course, that is a travesty. A terrible, horrible waste of human life which has to be stopped. And yet, on the other hand, I can't help but think of a tale told by that Greek fella Aesop. The goose that laid the golden egg. With the ability to transmute organic matter into gold, one could create infinite wealth. Use your imagination. Golden animals, insects, trees and plants. The Midas touch without the drawbacks. We are talking riches beyond imagining. And even if we were to split all those riches between the two of us, half of infinite wealth is still infinite. Interested? Hát igen, az aranytojás tojótyúk. Hát itt... Goose, de mindegy az. Look, I might have skimmed over that one, but don't be so pedantic. Are you interested or not? Oh, I'm not suggesting we use such a bow on people. There's no profit in breaking the golden rule. 
Excellent. So the first question is, how do we get our hands on one of those golden bows? Now, I have a plan. But first, tell me, are you familiar with the story of the goddess Diana? No problem. Allow me to explain. Diana is our goddess of the hunt, the moon, and the underworld, depending on who you ask. The one thing priests and poets agree on is that she carried with her a golden bow and a quiver of golden arrows. And it just so happens that there is a shrine of Diana in this very forum with a prominent statue of the goddess herself. And would you like to guess what she's holding in her hand? Most itt adni a kérdés nem gond, meg ö, pár gondolatot elmondhatok róla, csak tudod ilyen pénzügyi dolgokról, azt, azt nyilvánosan nem beszéltek. Twitch, Twitch szabályzat. Precisely. I can't tell you how many hours I've spent in that temple staring at it, trying to figure out how to retrieve it without breaking, you know what. De most mi, mi? Oh, no. If you tried that, we'd all be dead within moments, I'm sure. No, here's what I propose. You give your bow to me, I cover it in a thin layer of gold leaf, and we create a replica of a golden bow. Then, you enter the shrine, extinguish the braziers, and under cover of darkness, swap out the fake for the original. It's not theft, exactly. It's more of a... a trade. But make no mistake, this is a dangerous path, and there's no way of knowing where it will lead. But in my experience, all the best adventures begin with a risky first step. Now, you must have questions. Ask away. Dizius, uh, shock what a drug, Serintem. So, are you in, partner? Action or horror elements? Are you sure? Last chance. Now, if you'll end up with bag, I can get started applying a layer of gold leaf. This is a quality weapon. Now, bear with me for a moment. And here we are, a gold leaf bow. In in the mirror, that in all sorts of things. Now, I've got to unlock the shrine of Diana for you, so as quick as you can, head on inside. Should I know Diana? Just at the end of the street on the left. May the gods not watch over you. De szerintem ez nem így működik egyébként. Na mindegy, uh, hát próbáljuk meg. És azt kéne kicserélni? Hát de hogy? Mármint hogy... Ja, először el kell voltani. Jó, hát most már biztos nem látja. És hogy cseréljem ki? Az előbb pedig már, mint a fölvillant volna.
Igen, 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 Sheridan, így csak rossz volt a szög. Um, Is that you, partner? Do you have the bow? Wonderful. Just go ahead and slide it under the door for me and I'll unlock it for you. A little bit slow, aren't you? Yes, I locked you in. And until you give me my bow, you're gonna stay in there, like Tantalus in Tartarus. <laughs> no, technically, I never said that. Advert. I said, if we were to split all those riches between the two of us, infinite wealth is still infinite. It's hardly my fault if you can't tell the difference between a hypothetical and a promise now, is it? Oh, I do love a good loophole. Fenyegessük? You're just gonna have to take your chances, I'm afraid. The bow. Now, and don't even think about giving me the fake one. I'll recognize my own handiwork. Hmm. I would reconsider my position quickly if I were you. I'm not sure if you noticed, but you're stuck in there with a hornet's nest, and they can be rather aggressive toward intruders. You know, some say it takes 27 hornet stings to kill a man. But I always wondered how anyone could have known that. Let's find out how many it takes to kill a woman, shall we? Um. Goodbye. Hm. Hát nem adtuk oda neki. Kicsit algás a víz. You will understand what I've done and why I had to do it. The others will call me mad or a monster, but I don't care what they think. Everything I'm doing here, I'm doing for you. I'll start at the beginning. Soon after my arrival here, as I walked down a corridor lined with golden statues, I thought I heard a whisper behind me, a rasp of air as if vocal cords of metal strained to say a word or two. I tried to dismiss the idea, tried to concentrate on my work as the city's medic, but that tortured whisper haunted me. Weeks later, in the hallway to the bathhouse, I heard it again and found myself drawn to the statue of a Roman woman wearing a stola. Her face was contorted with anguish and fear, and disturbingly, it was as if she was looking right at me. As I walked past her, I heard that strained whisper again. And turning back, I discovered that even though I had moved, she was still looking right into my soul. That was when it dawned on me. 
This was no statue. This was a woman trapped within that golden prison. Naturally, I told the others, but when I could not reproduce the results of my experiment, they would not believe me. But from that moment on, I knew the full horror of this place. Immobilized within these statues are living human beings. It was that day, my love, that my heart broke. Oké, okay, tehát Névia rájött a, a dologra, hogy ezekben az arany szobrokban igazából emberek vannak. Hmm. Oké. Okay. Hmm. Ott a jobb sorokban mit jelenthet? Gondolom nem túl jót. Vagy mi? Jó, bal. Bocsánat. Itt a fejem mögött egyébként. De most miért nem tudok ide följönni? Oda kéne átugrani. Végül is át lehet. Springon majd hasznos lehet, aha. Jogos, amúgy. Igen, itt a fej mögött van, hogy 27 nyilam van. Um. Jogos top soros, igen, mert azokat is meglőttem volna, de igen, így, így nem volt rá szükség. Hek. Meghekkeltem a játékot. Ó, és itt a palota, ahol névia van. Rem. 
remélhetőleg. Na nézzünk szét, hát ha találunk valamit. Hát lehet, hogy ő névi az, szóval... Gondolom, mint most akkor egy kicsit lövöldöznünk kell majd. Elég innen. Nagyon szívesen, bármikor. <gül> Nagyon vicces. Mondasz valamit? Stop soros. Mert hogy az autó rendszer az volt már egy átvert, maradjunk annyiban. Inkább cserben hagyott. Fermented fish sauce. Garum. Nagyon jó, örülök neki. Na menjünk föl. Kérdezzük meg Néviát, hogy mi a helyzet. Névia egyébként... Hát nem erre kell menni. Ez már biztos. Névia egyébként nem Spartacusba... A Spartacus sorozatba hívták így az egyik főszereplőn... Egyik szereplőnek a barátnőjét. Hogy Névia? Mintha így ez rém lenne. Vagy mégis arra kell menni csak? Névia. Vagy valami ilyesmi volt. Nem. Merre kell jönni. Esetleg arra. Nem, nem erre. Szomorú, mert nem tudom merre kell menni.
nem is erre. Um. Pedig mutatná az irányt, hogy hogy vannak a akadályok elhelyezve. Tehát biztos, hogy nem erre kell jönni. Oké, okay, this way, de... Ott miért nem tudok bemenni? Tehát nagy valószínűség erre kéne jönni, de... Most lőjek bele ebbe is. Lövöldözök össze-vissza. Nem tudom. Mondja, hogy this way, csak... Azt nem, hogy melyik. This way. Oké, okay, akkor jövök erre. De erre sincs semmi. Valami kulcs kéne, vagy... Nem tudom. Erre se tudok menni. Oh. Change. Mondjuk az, hogy ez a aranyember itt eljött erre, ez valami... Kéne tovább menni, de... Akartam szaladni. Most ezt mindent le kell lőnöm, amúgy gondolom. Hol a... Igen, a vízbe kéne lőnöm, de most hol van a... Nem volt nálam a bó. Az Isten ez. Um. Magát elővette. V. 
Peace, lad. Fővettük ezt a pár nyilat. Jó, kicsit, kicsit tenyészkes, de megy az, csak igen, picit, picit tenyészkes a, a mászás. Lehet, lehet ő volt amúgy. Lehet néve a... ...lőtte őket részben szitává. Köszönöm tovább ezeket. Jó, ö, akkor itt vagyunk. Hol vagyunk? Coin pouch. Ó, 75 pénz. Oké. Okay. Jó. Én itt mást nem látok. Menjünk tovább. Még egy kis pénz. Parancsolj!
Oké. Okay. Bele, bele kellett őket csalni ide az algába. Így akkor már egyszerű volt megölni őket. Fú, hát jó nagy rumli van itt. Oké. Okay. Oké. Okay. Gyerünk tovább. Zárva van. <laughs> My beloved Galatea, after I learned the terrible truth about the golden statues, I wandered the city as if in a nightmare. What must life be like for these poor souls, entombed in gold, but kept alive somehow? Trapped in their own personal Tartarus, consigned to eternal torment, too horrific for any sane mind to comprehend. I tried to offer them what small mercies I could. I began to talk to them, to keep them company. I'd imagine backstories for them, give them names, and tell them of the world, of the histories and stories I'd learned as a child. As the others became more concerned by my charity, I sought solitude from them, preferring the company of my tormented charges. Discovering a way into the abandoned palace, I began to spend my days walking its halls and sharing with its occupants ancient tales, my mind turning to those of Apollo and Daphne, Perseus and Medusa, and Pygmalion and Galatea. Pygmalion, the sculptor who fell in love with a beautiful statue, and who, praying to Aphrodite for aid, discovered that his beloved Galatea had come to life. It was then that I heard you whisper to me, Galatea. Forgive me. I know that is not your real name, just one I have borrowed from a story. But when I turned to look at you, I saw the most exquisitely beautiful woman I have ever known. Your face forever frozen in a look of haunting sadness. Our meeting gave me new purpose to free you from your golden prison so that I might one day hear you speak, not just whisper your true name to me. So I gathered tools for the long and difficult task ahead, barred the doors to this place, and set to work. Uh -huh. Okay. That it did tell you that you... Why did you do this? Ha marad nálam a végén pár coin, az... Hát igen, a jelenben sokat érhet. Ja, ja. Gyűjtögetjük a pénzt. Okvetlenül. Nem tudom minek, de... Más nem majd veszünk belőle gyantát. Oké... Ez egy taktikai rúgás volt. Egy kis HP jó jönne amúgy.
Hova megyünk most? <gül> ide, ide jövünk le? Nem, itt voltunk az előbb. Ja, oda. Aha. És oda át tudunk menni. Ja, lehet, hogy ott a falon tudunk átmászni. Aha. Na, akkor újra. Igen, 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 Nevermind valószínű a falon. Még egy ott johnny a háttérben, de semmi gond, mert... Ez is taktikai volt. Oké, okay, itt nincsenek. A zsúrnál, viszont el, naplót elolvasjuk. My attempts at freeing these souls from their golden prisons have not been going to plan. My first charge was a Greek woman, who I called Iodami after the Athenian turned to stone by Medusa. Drilling through the gold that encased her, I was vindicated by the discovery that beneath half an inch of gold, which is so rigid it must be some kind of alloy, was living flesh. Unfortunately, This golden alloy seems to have fused with her skin, so removing it exposed the sinew and muscle beneath, and appeared to cause her great pain. At first, I braced myself, expecting that inflicting such pain would break the golden rule, and yet, somehow, it did not. It seems whichever god is responsible for imprisoning these poor souls does not care about their suffering at all. They are forsaken. Undeterred, I pressed on, working late into the night, attempting to remove the golden mm -hmm. layer that he placed as delicately as I could. Eventually, I was able to free most of her body, but when I released her from her restraints, her first act was to lunge for my throat, 
clawing at me with all her strength and those sharp metal talons. This was my thanks for trying to save her. Whatever possessed Iodami to attack, she was clearly not a suitable subject for my experiment, and I was forced to lock her inside an isolated wing of the palace and bar the door. As I continued working on others, I could hear her flailing and launching herself at the other side endlessly. Regrettably, my other experiments bore similar results, and after relocating a few times, most of the palace is now too dangerous to work in. Still, as much as my heart aches to know that you're suffering, I cannot risk attempting to ungild you yet. Not until I have perfected a method that will bring you back to me, whole in both mind and body, and ensuring your humanity is preserved. I promise you this. One day we will be together, even if I have to free every last statue in this god's forsaken place. Hmm. Igen, akkor ő próbált uh, kísérletezni. Mm, hát igen. Váltok majd percet, megnézek valamit. Oké. Na. Jó, tehát ő... Névia próbált... Kis... Az áthatolhatatlan sámli. Tehát ő próbált kísérletezni, hogy... Megszabadítja a szobrokat. Tehát, hogy meg... Headshot. Edith Adri, köszönöm szépen a tízest. Az igazából két ötös. Köszönöm szépen. Nevermind, ez egy nagyon jó kérdés. De tudod, ez olyan, hogy a, a kísérletezés az... az ilyen. Tehát az első nem sikerül akkor az ö, könnyen lehet, hogy azt mondja, hogy hát lehet, hogy nem ő volt a legjobb a legjobb ö, alany, vagy vagy, vagy ilyesmi aztán próbálja megint amúgy Shedit Adri, ez is lehet, igen tehát, hogy nem érdekelte a... Hogy az idegenekkel mi van, mert ő meg akarta a szerelmét szabadítani. Ó, basszus. Matematikus ön. Igen. Egy jó matematikus. Itt volt azért uh, egy kis... Egy kis pityputy. Na. Itt is vagyunk. Closer. Hello. And 
you must be the wretched snake who broke into my palace and disturbed my experiments. And worst of all, look at what you made me do to her. This never would have happened if you just stayed away. You're going to pay for that. Essa como os boss fight. Liar. I locked and barred the gate. I left a message warning you all to leave me alone. I just wanted to do my experiments in peace for her. And now look at her. You made me turn the most beautiful woman I've ever seen into this. Look at her. She's in agony. All I wanted was to spend my last moments with her, to see her beautiful face, to hear her speak freely instead of in those cryptic whispers. But as soon as I began my work, she stopped whispering to me. And now I discover she started whispering to you instead. What's so special about you? What do you mean the same voice? Ha oh, tehát olyan, hát igen olyan, mint hogyha valaki a szobrokon keresztül eh, suttogna hmm. hozzánk. Yes, I remember when they used to whisper to me. They did sound similar. I just thought it was because all voices sound the same when they whisper. But now that I think about it. They were all benevolent, and seemed to share a common knowledge. But if these bodies are mere conduits for that one voice, then this body is nobody. And everything I've done here was... was... Utter what? nonsense. I see what you're doing. You're trying to steal her away from me. Are you planning to wait until I've done all the hard work, then swoop in? Is that it? Dogeish. Liar. You tried to steal her away from me. And now look what you made me do. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't peel you too. What? What are you talking about? That we let the new carrier to Kida. I got trapped in tunnels under the city again. Hát tulajdonképpen. So you're saying you weren't coming for us? Hát nem, bár én nekem volna egy kis dolgom veled. So I did all this. I ruined her. For nothing. What have I done? Oh God, I feel sick. I am. I can't bear the thought of her being like this. And in so much pain. It's the air. Coming into contact with her flesh, it's agonizing for them. But the only way to fix it will be to break the golden rule and let it run its course. At least that way she'd be golden again, and we'd be together. All it would take is one little cut. Na, ez zseniális. Mindent vissza tudok csinálni, ha elmondod, hogy mi a gyógymód reumára. It's too late. There's nothing you can do. I have to do this. I'm sorry. De ne! What? How? Really? I, I'm not sure I believe you. But if you can undo this mess, I'll tell you what you need to know. But if you're lying to me, I'll break the golden rule and kill you and everyone else in this city. Understood? Jó, csak mondd, hogy mi a gyógymód reumára. És akkor most... Öm, simán csak lőjem le. You did 
it. You took away her pain. I don't know what to say. Thank you. Thank you. I will see I, swear, I will never harm her again. I swear it. I'll stay here to keep her company. But these poor souls, what can be done for them? I've tried everything I can. I fear the only one capable of releasing them properly is whichever god doomed them in the first place. In any case, I must honor our bargain. The treatment for rheumatism is willow bark. I believe there's a pot of it already in the Shrine of Apollo. Now, please leave. The door here leads out onto the palace balcony. You should be able to make your way down from there. No, you will. Go. And never return. Heedless. Um. Okay, akkor... Várja, hol a kiárat? Erre vagy másik irány? Jönnék visszafele. What? Are you still here? Ó, oh, és le lehet zipline Oké. Okay. Na. Oké. Okay. De érdekesek a fények. De never mind, ha őt is rálövöm, akkor az, az Golden Rule, nem? The Priestess. What Priestess? Dano F. Hát igen, mondjuk egy F-öt nyomhattam volna. Ja. Hello, Lucrezia. What are you doing in here? Can't you see this woman is dying? She's been poisoned. She needs the resin of a plant called Silphium, but that Kulas Kumbolates taste is not give it to me. A reuma az kinek kellett? Mi már elfelejtettem. She just slipped away. No, no, now's fine. I can't afford to wallow here. And I need the distraction. What's on your mind? You made it into the palace. I'm impressed. How is it? Willow back. I should have known. It was under my nose the whole time. That's very helpful. Thank you. If this works, it should settle Rufius down some. I have some right here. Could you do me a favor and give him some of this? He'll just need to swallow a pinch of it. I'm hoping it will avert disaster. Rufius, no. Okay. Thank you. I'm really glad you arrived when you did. Okay. All right. Well, thanks again for helping remove the thorn from the lion's paw. The spirit of Androcles smiles upon you. Shoka tendu. Um. Az az Wakanda forever. Um. Nézzük akkor meg beszéljünk. Shiny. Fabiával. Hello. You. You took care of him. An accident? So, it's over? Oh, God. That's such a relief. I really thought we were all going to die. I... I do have a question, though. That shrine, the one I was going to hide in, did you... know it was going to collapse? Better. Really? Then how? Oh, I see. Oh, I should probably keep my big mouth shut then. Sorry. I promise nobody else will ever know what you did. But I know. That was really clever. Thank you. 
I'm glad you're here. Oh, speaking of which, welcome. I'm Fabia. Sorry, I was a bit frantic before. Need anything? Az lenne a kérdésem, hogy rokona, rokona vagy-e Oktáviának. De mindjárt. Ó, oh, szemmel. Warframe. Na, ez egy nagyon érdekes kérés. Oké, okay, oké. Okay. Pörögni fog. Mindenképp. Mindenképp. Na, egy percet várjatok, mert ha már szemmel kérte, akkor újra töltöm a, a teát. És vagyok. Na, bocsi, csak a hátsó épületből kellett fölhoznom. <gül> Oké. Okay. Hát, ö, meglátjuk. Egyelőre még azért nem vagyok annyira elhavazva ilyen játékkérésekkel, szóval van most pár de azok nem annyira vészesen hosszúak. Jó, akkor beszélgessünk Fábiával. There's not much to tell. I mostly just bake bread and try to help out where I can. I suppose it all started about eight months ago. I was living in Rome with my family when I got sick. Terrible timing. My pa had just arranged a husband for me. Fisherman's son. Arranged. I was about to meet him for the first time when I came down with an awful fever. I spent the next week in bed. Pa paid priests to make offerings to Asclepius, a white rooster, then a goat. But nothing worked. In the end, they decided I'd do better outside the city. Clean air in the countryside would do me good, they said. But after about a day in a carriage on the Appian Way, I was getting worse. Not better. I remember closing my eyes for a bit, and I guess I must have fell asleep because when I opened them again, I was in a forest by a river. I suppose the driver took off with his fee and left me for dead. Can't say I blame him. I wouldn't have wanted to catch what I had either. Anyway, I went searching for help, stumbled across the trapdoor temple, and here I am. That you is very often you carry it there. That's very interesting. Ó, oh, never mind. Nagyon szépen köszönöm a subgiftet, amit szemhelnek ajándékoztál. 
Köszi szépen a támogatást. Oké, okay, hát igen, ez alapvetően szomorú. Nice of you to say. But you should save your sympathy. Lots of people here need it more than I do. Oké. Okay. Goldenról. Oké, okay, Virgil. Igen, mert ő látta azt, hogy ki rajzolja a graffitit Virgil falára. Ugye a sváb gyerek. Mm, terrible shame that is. Maybe this will help. Late last night, I was cleaning my oven when I heard some noises out. Szerintem olyan 40-50-es közötti fickó lesz. Oh, it's that hour. So I came out to see what was going on. To be honest, I thought maybe poor old Dooley had got out of his cell and was snooping around again. So I put my head out and saw someone in front of Virgil's shop. I couldn't tell who. It was too dark. I called out to them, but they just turned and ran off without a word. All I remember is they ran past a lit torch and the light glinted off something metallic. Armor, I think. So I suppose it could only be one of three people. Horatius, Domitius or Rufius. I hope that helps. Horatius, Domitius or Rufius. Hello, Para. Igen, a Skód Gladiator, a Sváb Kovács, vagy nem is tudom, építész, bocsánat. Brutális, mik vannak itt. Oké, okay, tehát akkor a, az ellenzék miniszterelnök jelöltjét ő nem gyanúsítja. Tehát szerintem nem ő volt. Try not to worry about it. I mean, if people are nice to each other, we won't have anything to worry about, will we? Ennyire egyszerű. Legyetek egymáshoz kedvesek. Thanks. And I like your teeth. They're so white. And your clothes. Pont most voltam fogkülesedésen, csak mondom. Az érjen szépek a fogaim. And I'm sure he'd love to chatter about the golden rule with you too. He'll be just across the forum in his shop. All right. Thanks again for taking care of our problem. I won't forget it. Okay. Here I come again, can you let? Um. No. Akkor mit kellene most csinálnunk? Rufiusnak kellene adnunk. Ó, oh, segítsetek, Willow Bark. A Millert a rontott a kontraszton. Már azon a Miller, arra Millert arra gondolsz, amit te fogyasztottál, para vagy. Fűzfa kéreg. Sose találtam volna ki. Jó, Rufius, szal szerintem még... Beszéltünk mi rufius -szal? Ne, Én nem emlékszem rá. Bár az semmit nem jelent, hogy én nem emlékszem rá. Oké. Okay. Jó, hát Dézius-t kéne még mindig valahogy puhítani, hogy adjon gyantát. Oké. Okay. Jó, hát igen, ez még várat magára. Ja, igen, hogy ki az, aki majd a bűnt, bűnt elköveti. Te emlékszel, hogy nem. Oké. Okay. Jó, jó, jó. Oké. Okay. Én, én, én is úgy emlékszem, hogy, hogy, hogy nem beszéltünk vele. Igen, meg kéne... Oké, okay, tehát Virgil még mindig függőben van. És akkor itt van ez a Domis, ez Hore és ez Rufius trió. Tehát először is beszélnem kéne velük, és fel átkutatni az otthonaikat. Oké. Okay. És megkérdezzük Malaloszt, hogy ő Quinctus-e, bár szerintem az triggerelni fog megint egy, egy, egy menekülést. 
mert szerintem meg fog ölni minket, hogyha szembesítjük vele. Na mindegy, próbáljuk meg ezt. Irány melelósz. That's quite an impressive bow you have there. Just like Diana's. A new face. Are they? And may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. To what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? Várj, tök már egy kicsit. Um, soon, I hope. Mindjárt csak. Um, annyira hangos a zene. Hová? Hogy nem hallom tőle a... A beszédet. Arve again. Did you find what you need? Te. Oh my. I take it people are quite direct where you're from. I suppose it's quite charming in its own way. Usually, however, you wouldn't simply march up to a vestal priestess and without due formality or courtesy ask, what is your story? Vestal priestess. The proper approach would be to arrange an introduction through a mutual acquaintance in high office, by which time you would already know how to address me. And then you would find a way to satisfy your curiosity rather more indirectly. But to be honest, I've often thought what an unnecessarily formal way to communicate that is. So, let's do it your way. You just keep being yourself and ask whatever you like. It'll be a... Refreshing change. That you're a Vesta Suez. Akkor az mondod cseri tadri. Hát elnézést, nem nem tudom, hogy hogy kell tőle megszólítanom. You know, I'm not entirely sure. But what about you? How did you end up here? Karen, you say. And nothing about that name seemed odd to you. <laughs> Why is that? The memes? What are the memes? So... A bit like Egyptian hieroglyphs, then. Így van pontosan. Igen, így van. So your people make hieroglyphics depicting this accursed character, the one they call Karen. Hmm. I wonder if. No. I apologize. I don't mean to be cryptic. It's just that you've got me thinking. Have you spoken with any of the others about how they arrived here too? I really think you should. Go around and ask them what they remember, and see if you notice any patterns. Oh, that well, I hope I can't fool up with any. Good. Thank you. Well, as a court, it's the fellow that told you. Be careful. 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 Up until a few weeks ago, she was a perfectly productive member of our little community, darning clothes and cutting hair. She was always so chatty, always seeking out newcomers and asking them where they were from and how they wound up here. And then, about a month ago, she suddenly changed. She withdrew, stopped working and became despondent, started muttering to herself. Galerius and I visited her to see how we could help, but she just looked at us with this haunted stare, called us bloodless shadows, and told us we were ignorant of some pattern. Look, it could be unrelated. Perhaps she simply fell ill, or, as Galerius suggested, the weight of the golden rule was too much for her. But there is a small chance. 
that she learned something, saw a pattern nobody else saw, and that it broke her. I just hmm. don't want to see that happen to you. So be careful, will you? Hát egyébként az az érdeke, azt mégis jó, oké, vigyázzunk magunkra, de valóban volt, van egy ilyen, ilyen pattern, hogy, hogy igazából senki nem tudja pontosan, hogy hogy került ide. Tehát egyszer csak úgy, úgy kihúzták egy folyóból valami keren, és vagy, vagy úgy fölébredt a, a folyóparton. Hát igen, és a folyó volt a... Yes, I understand many of our friends were carried here by a river current. What else? Hát egyelőre ennyi. Hmm. There are definitely some common threads there. But I think we'll need at least a few to ensure we're not just seeing coincidences. Keep asking people how they wound up here. I don't want us to rush to any conclusions yet. Livia's fate weighs heavily on my mind and dictates we should be sure. Yes, you should ask the others first. Beszéljek Karen menedzserével. Hát vagy a menedzser beszéljen Karen panaszával. Szerintem az lenne a legjobb. I don't I'm afraid. It seems to me we're exiled here until the gods judge us, one way or another. Uh -huh. I'm quite sure it's the work of the gods, which is strange because they've never been particularly concerned with our misdeeds, as long as we've kept the peace of the gods. We asked for blessings, for good health, bountiful harvest, military victory, and in return, we offer praise, wine, incense, or animals. But here, it seems they require much more of us. I find myself reminded of an especially pertinent tale from our great poet Ovid in his epic Metamorphoses. Would you like to hear it? It is rather long. Ovid? Hmm. Wonderful. It goes like this. Baucis and Philemon were an old married couple living a humble life in a small town. One night, the town gets a visit from a couple of vagrants. They go from door to door, asking for a place to stay the night. Of course, being vagrants, they're turned away sharply from house after house, a thousand in all, until finally they come to the little cottage where Baucis and Philemon live. Now the kind old couple had very little to offer, but nevertheless, they invite these strangers into their house and offer them food, wine, and a place to stay. Immediately, the guests make themselves at home. They begin gulping down the old couple's wine, so much so that Baucis, the old lady, begins to worry they're going to run out. And then she notices something strange. Her wine pitcher keeps refilling itself, as if by magic, realizing only a select few possess such powers. Says to her husband, Philemon, I think these men are gods in disguise. Immediately, the couple begins apologizing for offering such coarse wine, and the vagrants metamorphosize and reveal themselves to be Jupiter, the king of the gods, and Mercury, the trickster god. They confide they didn't mind the meager offerings. They were just pleased that someone in the town offered them hospitality. Then Jupiter says to them, You have passed our test, but everyone else in this city failed, so we are going to destroy this place and everyone in it, Except you, who we will grant a wish. So old Baucis and Philemon escape up into the mountains safely, and they receive their wish, which is for eternity together. Meanwhile, Jupiter carries through with his threat and wipes that city off the map. Some say the moral of that story is that we must all honor the sacred rituals of guest friendship, the reciprocal obligations owed between hosts and guests. But I like to think it's that we should always show compassion for those less fortunate than ourselves. Hmm. I'm pleased to hear it. Hát igen. Azt mondod, hogy Athéni a, a Karen, Shelly Tadri. Hát, ami lehet. 
Mi a helyzet a választás? Ez egy nagyon fontos kérdés. Dusk, Sentius, incumbent, Maliolus, Why do you ask? All of the male citizens who are willing and able to attend. Tehát csak a férfiak. Csak a férfiak szavazhatnak. Hmm. That's just the way it's always been, I'm afraid. It never sat right with me either. There are some women who can vote, vestal priestesses like myself, but in this case, given my role overseeing the election, I've decided to abstain. I can't allow the perception that I'm being anything but fair and independent. But if it's any consolation, there are other ways to influence the outcome of an election. Like uh, gerrymandering. As to get okay, I'm telling. By using whatever gifts the gods gave you, nothing untoward, of course. A gerrymandering az... Hát, na várok egy kicsit hát, ha valaki leírja, aki tudja. Addig körbe kérdezek itt a... Vagy megkérdezem itt a választás kapcsán. You can, assuming they're eligible and willing to accept the nomination. Oké, lehet másokat is jelölni. Hát most elkezdeni. I'm planning to hold it before dusk. Nem plan naplement előtt kell. Because I could hold it sooner, if there's a good reason. Hmm. Yes. I have overheard some rather unpleasant arguments. The last thing we need here is additional conflict. Very well. I'll get things started right away. Citizens, it is time. Let us meet to elect our magistrate. It's time. The elections on. Na gyerünk. Én is szavaznék. Ja, én nem szavazhatok, mert nő vagyok. Így van, stop soros. Tehát úgy húzod meg a választókerületeket, hogy pont jó legyen. Nem tudom honnan ismerős ez. De a New York Times-on láttam egy ö, játékot, ahol pont ez volt a, a cél, hogy a, 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 az a párt nyerjen, amíg ö, neked szimpatikus. Hát Amerikában ugye ez a... Ugye a Demokrata vagy republikánus. Jó, vannak ott is más pártok, de azok, azok nagyon kevés szavazatot szoktak kapni. She will guide you. Oké. Okay. Úgy, úgy gondolod, Nevermind, hogy csak Amerikában van ilyen? Csak mondanám, hogy... Á, ah, nem, inkább nem mondom. Ott ilyen Malelus. Maleolus. Citizens! We have a quorate body of voters gathered here to elect the city's magistrate. The candidates are Sextus Sentius Imperiosus and Marcus Maliolus Gerges. As agreed, we shall dispense with ballots and candidates will abstain from voting. Let's make this quick. As I say your name, call your vote. I'll start with you, Horatius. Sentius, of course. Georgius. Maliolus. Dacius. Maliolus. Galerius. I abstain. I'm just here to observe. Virgil. Maliolus. Rufius. Maliolus. And finally, Domitius. Maliolus. Who else? Citizens, you have made your decision. Your new magistrate is Marcus Maliolus Gerges. 
Hail Magistrate Maliolus. Tehát kormányváltás lett. I said, Hail Magistrate Maliolus. That's more like it. Thank you. Thank you. I am delighted and deeply honored to have been elected your magistrate. And now, I make this solemn promise to you, good citizens. Under my leadership, you will finally enjoy the freedom you deserve. No more shall you walk on eggshells, fearing simply to live and breathe, because the tyrant Sentius told you it was forbidden. For my first act as magistrate, I hereby announce a day of celebration to mark the end of an era. The myth of the golden rule is no more. The golden rule is real, you idiot. For his attempt to deceive us all, Sentius is hereby found guilty of treason against the Empire. What? I have committed no crimes. This is madness. <laughs> his sentence to fight for his life in gladiatorial combat against Domitius. Here and now for your entertainment. It's in time for Tasha to begin. No idea what you're doing. You're going to get us all killed. Wait. I exercise my right as a Vestal priestess to pardon him. I will not allow you to do this. You're showing your true colors now, priestess. Your corruption sickens me. Domitius, ignore her. Proceed. This is insanity. You doom us all. Lies. It is time the golden rule was exposed for what it is. A children's fable. That was exploited by a treacherous leader to instill fear in all of us. This is why he's in his gladiator gear. They've been planning this all along. Uh, never mind. Shut up, all of you. Oh, oh, the magistrate has spoken. I'm going to enjoy killing you, old man. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Death and life. Stop! As magistrate. Köszi szépen, stop soros. Igen, uh, akkor ezek szerint ez akkor történik, amikor valamit nem úgy csinálok, ahogy, ahogy kellene. Um, Oké. Okay. Tehát akkor a lényeg az, ezt, ebből most azt tanultuk, hogy uh, önt nem lehet megválasztani. Hello, Yorjev. Salve, friend. Mind telling me who you are and what you're doing with that bow on your back? Oh, that sounds serious. I'm listening. All right, let me see. Stop Fabia going in, but send the new arrival to the empty shrine. Understood. I'll go, but once I'm done, I'll need you to tell me how you know all of this. Oh, never mind. Okay, because he has info. Yo, that as nem as akkor nem szabad hagyni, hogy a melóst megválasszák magistrátusnak. Ezek a hangok. Jó, szerintem itt még most... Uh, 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 hát... Uh, nagyon sokkal nem vagyunk közelebb azért a megoldáshoz. Hol van a... Hol a... Lehet, hogy ő majd csak később lesz itt. Na mindegy, uh, akkor elvileg Fábia túlélt a... Fickó, aki... Ki... 
Ah, what the fuck is cool? For the last time, Daisis, I'm not making you a bow. But why? You know why. But how am I going to defend myself against someone else with a weapon? There are no Sorry again, friend. I went and we did as you asked, and it worked. So it how is it possible? That's if you've just arrived here and you already know it. everyone and exactly what's about to happen to them. Most szakadt rá a csávóra a... <gül> Oké, okay. nem, nem, nem rögök, mert nem szép dolog. <gül> uh, you're toying with me, right? Wait, you're not kidding, are you? Nem, ez komoly. The only way you could have known. You're a bit like... Oh, what was his name? Sisyphus. Yeah, that's the one. Old King Sisyphus. Sisyphus was a Greek king a long time ago. For daring to think he could outsmart the gods, he was given a terrible punishment. He was forced to push a great boulder up to the top of a hill. Only, just as it reached the top, it would roll all the way back down to the bottom, forcing him to start over and over and over again for all eternity. Just like you. Actually, now that I think about it, there are a bunch of old stories about the gods punishing people by making them do the same futile task over and over. Tantalus was made to grasp at fruit on a tree he could never quite reach. The Bellides had to keep fetching water in a sieve. Oh, and Ixion was strapped to a wheel going round and round forever. But on the bright side, at least you're not stuck in the underworld like they all were. Anyway, I don't know which god you managed to upset to get yourself into this position, friend, but you seem all right to me. So I'll tell you what, I'll keep doing whatever I can to help you. And you just focus on finding a way Nail. to break the cycle you're in. Oh, that's kind of you to say. Now, I'm going to keep your secret. Although, it's not as if I'll remember this next time we talk anyway, right? <laughs> oh, and if our conversations ever start to annoy you, just tell me you're busy. I know when I'm not wanted. May fortune smile on you, friend. Okay. Now, let's see if we can you can make loot on it. Hmm. Igen, mert lehet, hogy ezt eltesszük majd. Jó, mondjuk ez nem olyan érdekes. A dénát, azt, dénát mindenképp eltesszük. Azon gondolkodom... Igen, a 12 minutes az... Csak ott ugye fixen mindig újraindult a, a dolog, függetlenül attól, hogy mit csináltam. Tehát előbb-utóbb mindig újraindult. Whatever's in that great temple up there on the bluff, I bet it's worth a fortune. Hogy el tudnánk a bizniszelni az íjat. Szavasz. Hello there, friend. May I say that is a glorious bow you're carrying. Do you mind if I ask where you acquired it? Well, I think you're worth it, but perhaps you'd be interested in selling it to me. I mean, it's not as if you have any use for it down here. Ah, az a baj nem tudjuk az az tele odaadni neki, amit most rútoltunk, hanem mindenképp az aranyozottat. Hú, never mind. Örülök, hogy ha most így abba játékba tudom követni, nem hogy még bezavarsz. Ami nem bezavarsz, hanem bekavarsz, pontosabban. Így is teljesen össze vagyunk már lassan kavarodva. Oké, okay, tehát... For the right price, I will tell you where you can get your own. Now you're talking, I'm interested. How about a hundred denarii? Ugye, egy... Tehát ezer dénár volt a... A cucc, ami kell a, a doktornőnek, akinek 
Fogalma sincs arról, hogy mit csinál. Oh, that's a little excessive, don't you think? It's not the bow of Ulysses we're talking about. All right, all right. But I'm going to need you to tell me before I pay up. Um. Wait, wait, wait. Let's not be too hasty, friend. I just want a little assurance that I can trust you. That's all. Oké, okay, tehát itt, itt kiátszhatunk több kártyát is. Um, tehát az, hogy hát döntsd el, hogy mit akarsz. Tehát uh, kockáztas. Vagy azt mondjuk neki, hogy hát én is szereztem egyet, szóval akkor te is. Tehát akkor tudom, hogy hogy kell szerezni. Ugye? A harmadik az, hogy ugye a Golden Rule miatt nem hazudhatok. Tehát muszáj uh, az, megtartanom az ígéretemet. Mindig ugyanonnan megy a restart, csak ö, megtartom a cuccaimat. Így van, így van, ahogy stopsoros mondja, az inventory megmarad. Hmm. Hát nevermind, vagy ö, ha vittem magammal, akkor vagy valóban öregszem én is, vagy ö, csak a cuccok, amik nálam vannak. Arra nem emlékszem, hogy Dézius mit gondol a Golden Rule-ról, hogy komolyan veszi vagy nem. Szóval emiatt inkább ezt mondom. Hmm, I suppose you're right. All right, you drive a hard bargain, but here's your money. Ott Now, is van. The location of that bow. <laughs> Ez milyen paros lenne. Nem mondom erről, hogy meg. Uh, what? But I already knew that, you imbecile. Everyone knows that. I can't take that golden bow because stealing from the goddess in her own shrine would break the golden rule. You promised to tell me where I could get one of my own. What is this? Some kind of joke? I... I don't believe this is happening. Ez mókás volt, egyszer majd megpróbálhatnánk újra, vagy hát újra csinálhatnánk. Oké, okay. viszont az a baj, hogy így most nem nagyon fogunk tőle szerintem venni um, cuccot, bár megpróbáljuk azt mondani, hogy visszaadjuk az ezer dénárját. Nem. Uh, Oké. Okay. Hmm. Akkor lehet, hogy mégsem volt olyan okos ez a dolog. Na mindegy. De azért nem tudtuk ide irányítani a Shrinehoz, mert elvettük az íjat. Vagy egyébként se lehetett volna. Lőjem le és megmarad a pénz a resetnél. Hát vagy nem lelővöm, hanem még valamit csinálunk. Abba, mielőtt... Ö, mi, mielőtt megint... Oké, okay. na. Mindjárt még egy kicsit ö, dolgozunk itt a, a feladatokon. Oké. Okay. Hát elvileg akkor most már a pénz megvan, hogy megvegyük daisius a... a gyantát, amire szükségünk van. Jó, megvan a Rufiusnak ez a kéreg. Ezt is elvihetjük. Oké, okay, hát ez még itt függőbe van. Ez, ezt majd később nézzük meg. Um, és akkor ez itt is kell egy kis nyomozás. Rufiushoz úgyis, Rufius úgyis megyünk, úgyhogy akkor vele beszélgetünk egy kicsit. Ez meg a, a választással kapcsolatos, tehát a Malalusszal kellene beszélnünk majd, hogy ő Quinctus-e. Szerintem 
A, a se kizárt, hogy ha szembesítjük azzal, hogy kicsoda, akkor magától visszamondja ezt a választásos dolgot. Úgyhogy akkor szerintem irány Rufius, beszélünk vele, meg odaadjuk neki a <coughs> reumájára a gyógyszert. Name's Rufius. Better watch your step. What business is that of yours? Willow Park. And this will work? Oh, thank God. Finally, some relief. This is what I've been praying for. Maybe God hasn't abandoned me after all. Thank you. I've been in a lot of pain lately. The rheumatism, these cursed statues always watching in the crisis of faith. It was too much. Started messing with my head. This is exactly what I needed to set it straight again. I owe you one. Oké, tehát tartozik nekünk egy jel, ez nagyon fontos. Hát most itt direkt bekérdezzünk rá. Picit még szerintem... Can't talk long, got to stay sharp, but... Family's from Solusia on Tigris. Babylon province. But I've been Roman a long time now. Even joined the legions. The sixth. One they call ironclads. Igen, ez néztem, hogy di gad, mert ugye ott kérdezhetnéd, hogy ha bár itt írja, hogy római, mert ugye kérdezhetnéd, hogy na jó, de melyik, mert ugye ironclads. Bár csak jó lennék történelemből. Not sure. I was fighting with the sixth against Parthians in the east. Only my whole body was aching every time I took a swing of my gladius. It was the rheumatism. Relentless. Unending. Of course, I wasn't going to get any sympathy from my commander. So I started thinking. What if, in the next battle, I just didn't try as hard, you know? What if I let my guard down? Just long enough. Next battle came. And all I remember is this bloody great savage coming toward me. And I just... Loosened my grip. Hmm. And then nothing. I woke up by the river. Some strange man in an eagle headdress had fished me out. Kamut Tabal, I think he called himself. Then I found this place, and that's it. Okay, so there's another magic pattern. Ah, so they don't remember what happened to them. Ah, okay, so there's another magic pattern. 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 Ah, okay, so there's another No, I don't. I did hear a rumor that Aurelia, the tavern keeper, has been offering to sell a way out. But I barely have two sisters to rub together. Van kocsma, és még nem voltunk ott. Az hogy lehet? I'll tell you this much. I hate the fact that my survival depends on the common sense of other people. Ah, értem mire gondolsz. Oh, never mind. Are you sure? Or was I? This valami, valonnan ismerős egyébként. 
hogy egy folyón kísérték át a, a szellemeket. Valonnan ismerős, már nem tudom honnan. Hát nem, én biztos, hogy ne, nekem biztos, hogy nem a Wikipédiáról, de valahonnan. Igen, a Stix, az a Stix folyó, igen. De hol hallottam ezt? Lehet a... Hát... Vagy nyilván vagy történelm órán, vagy a Trója című filmbe. Na mindegy. I mean, all these people just bumble along like nothing's wrong. Well, we're one bad decision away from being wiped out. Like the last lot of people who lived here. Seems like I'm the only one ready for what's coming. Whatever that is. And when it hits, it's everyone for themselves. You've been warned. Mm -hmm. I don't know. But did you ever get the feeling some of these statues are watching us when we're not looking? Like they're waiting for something. I don't like it. Nem tudom, mire gondolhat. Hmm. That doesn't help me. Fú, never mind, ne is mond, tényleg folyóval kezdődik. Igen, amúgy sok ilyen túlvilági folyó van. És egyébként, hát attól félek, hogy a következő God of Kratos is át fog menni egy ilyenen. Bár nem tudom, hogy az Istenek átmennek-e a, a folyón, de... Na mindegy, meglátjuk majd. Kire fog szavazni? Meliolis. Not sure I trust Sentius. Couldn't even protect his daughter in a city without sin. How's he going to protect us? Mm -hmm. Fine. Hát igen, és itt azért csak úgy értem, hogy hogy végleg. De meglátjuk majd. No idea what you're talking about. Yeah. Prove it. Hmm. Nem sikerült rápirítanunk. Um. So you were on. Okay, that val. Hát még egyelőre akkor nem tudjuk, hogy ő az aki zaklatja a a a svább gyereket. De nem úgy sedít Adri, hanem a a storyban. Tehát hogy a Ragnaröknek az lesz a storya, hogy tehát hogy Kratos meghal. De nem, nem biztos, nem tudom amúgy, csak, csak valahonnan gyanús. Nem kell végigjátszani, ha hát igen, mielőtt meghalna kikapcsolód és akkor, akkor nem hal meg. Na jó, akkor uh, Rufiusból nem szedtünk ki semmit, esetleg kérdezzük meg a gladiátor gyereket, hogy... Just like Diana's. Éppen olyan. Na hát. A new face. Ave, and may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. To what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? Interesting. I'm not sure why you're telling me, but you've come to the right person. Did you find a pattern then? What have you noticed? Yes, I understand many of our friends were carried here by a river current. What else? That's true. I know I wasn't entirely sure how I wound up here. What else? Mm. There are definitely some common threads there. But I think we'll need at least a few to ensure we're not just seeing coincidences. Keep asking people how they wound up here. I don't want us to rush to any conclusions yet. Livia's fate weighs heavily on my mind and dictates we should be sure. Yes, you should ask the others first. Fear is proof of a degenerate mind. Okay. 
Egyelőre akkor... Uh, egyelőre több... Uh, kérdés nincs. Vagy hát több ilyen pattern nem találtunk. Hol is ez? What is it, citizen? Mi van állampolgár? Azt kérdezi. I'm a legionary of the first Italica. But there's not a lot of fighting down here. So the magistrate has assigned me other duties. I act as the magistrate's right-hand man, keeping an eye on his daughters. Uh, daughter, I should say. And the others. And making sure they're all behaving. I also keep a register of new arrivals. Mm-hmm. Tehát igazából ő akar a magisztrétnek a jobb keze. Um, Oké. Okay. I'm from Liguria, up north originally. I was doing all right for myself. 12 years into my service. Had a nice girl lined up for when it was all over. Not anymore. She's probably figured I'm long gone and moved on by now. I try not to think about it. My commander sent me to deliver a message to Rome. While I was there, I thought I'd do something nice for my girl and pick up a little pendant from a silversmith. That's when the crowd started flooding through the streets, shouting fire. People were screaming, trampling each other. Then some genetric and future chill tried to take advantage of the chaos and pinch my pendant. I remember chasing him through the crowds, down towards the river. And then, nothing. Blacked out and woke up near here. No idea how I ended up floating so far down river. But I'm fortunate to be alive, I suppose. Ah, don't be. As Seneca the Younger said, difficulty strengthen the mind as labor does the body. Seneca. Said, mm. Centilla's disappearance has been more difficult than I'd care to admit. Okay. Tehát akkor ő is emlékszik, hogy, hogy hogy került ide. Igazából a, a tűz idején ö, történt valami vele is. He's one of the better commanders I've ever had. That's for sure. Good stoic. Lives by Seneca's words. Treat your inferior as you would wish your superior to treat you. Can't ask for much more than that. I went around asking the same questions when I first arrived. Never did find a way out. But I learned how to accept my situation. To bear trials with a calm mind robs misfortune of its strength and burden. That's from Seneca the Younger, if you're interested. Seneca nagyon ismeri, maradjunk annyiból. Nézhetnénk a népesség nyilvántartót. I don't see why not. Just make sure I get it back by tomorrow. Oké, okay. azt mondja, hogy Aurelio, vagy Aurelia, igen. Commoner Tavern Keeper, tehát ő a kocsmáros. Tavern in Slam. És azt állítja, hogy ő tud egy kiutat. Oké, okay. Claudia. Tehát most kaptunk egy, egy népesség nyilvántartó gyakorlatilag. Ez mondjuk nem haszontalan dolog. Not sure why you said it like that, but whatever. Show on them couple of visa. Go there. Well, as I always say, it's kind of like a 
divine version of the practice of decimation in the Legion, by threatening to execute one in ten men. The idea is to ensure order and discipline among everyone, and it works. If you knew you could be executed because your brother-in-arms is planning a mutiny, well, you'd bloody well watch him like hundred-eyed Argus, wouldn't you? Because your only chance of saving yourself is to stop bad things before they happen. Makes us all responsible for keeping each other in check. It's brutal, of course, but effective. The Legion wouldn't be the most formidable force in the world without it. Collective punishment. Az egy háborús bűn. Hát mondjuk háború idején biztos. War crime. Isn't that a contradiction in terms? As Cicero said, in times of war, the law falls silent. Ez egy olvasott fickó, azt mindenképp meg kell hagyni. Hát igen, a Genfi Egyezmény még ilyenkor nem létezett, az biztos. Még nagyon Genfse, ja. Seems that way. War crimes. Ridiculous. What's done is done. I was forced to execute my brothers in arms and those memories will always visit me in my sleep. But... Life is harsh, and I've come to accept my lot. As with the golden rule, I don't have any control over it. So railing against it would be like trying to stop the seasons or the tides. As Seneca the Younger wrote, true happiness is to enjoy the present without anxious dependence upon the future. Not to amuse ourselves with either hopes or fears, but to rest satisfied with what we have, which is sufficient. For he that is so wants nothing. If you like. Philosophia is not on perug. Not that it's any of your business, but my loyalty is and always will be with Sentius. Had again, but as you remember. I don't think my vote is going to make any difference today. See, Demetius has been going around town, shoring up votes for Maliolus with lies, bribery, and intimidation. The man's a savage. But he's a gladiator, so people fear and respect him more than they should. Sentius knows about it, of course, but he doesn't have the same rat cunning as Maliolus. This place will be different with that sleaze at the helm. But I try not to worry about things I can't change. Hát, Shady Dadri Cicero-tól is idézett az imént. Hát akkoriban azért olyan sok más minden nem volt. Okay. I appreciate the thought, but you're new here, and I just can't see how you could make an impact in the time between now and the election this afternoon. In any case, if you're interested in the election, go and have a chat with Equitia, the Vestal Priestess. She'll be overseeing proceedings. Okay, it's a melted amuj. Okay, mi a helyzet Virgil? What? Absolutely not. I know someone's been threatening him. And I'm not happy about it, but I can assure you, it isn't me. Hát, amúgy jó fejnek tűnik ez a horés ez. Mondjuk lehet, hogy pont az érő az, de nem hinném. Hát Szenekát, meg Cicero-t olvas, hát csak nem. Alright. Jó, akkor... Hát igen, Nevermind, mondjuk ez igaz. Mindig elfelejtem, hogy... Hát úgy, hogy te egy gyökér vagy. Én meg nem. Maliolus isn't receiving visitors at the moment. It being election day. Nem is ővel akarok beszélni. Do I seem like anonymous threats in my style? I can. Valóban stopsolos ez mindig elfelejtem. You don't know Sturkus. Sturkus. Van egy sejtés, ami az mit jelent? When Maliolus wins the election, yeah, this place will change. You won't even want to leave. You'll see. 
Az a helyzet, hogy whatever. Just remember, I'll be watching. Hogy továbbra se tudjuk, hogy ki az aki fenyegeti. Szerintem nem Horace ez, hogy Horáció, hanem a másik kettő közül lehet valami. Na most ezek el is tűntek innen. Na mindegy, fölmegyünk, kicsit megszorongatjuk a um, Meliolust, hogy uh, ha oda találok persze, csak mert um, le kéne beszélni arról, hogy elinduljon a választásokon. Meg itt szaladt egy nő. Mondjuk az a nő, azt a nőt már máshol is láttam szaladni. Salve, friend. I'm Octavia. Welcome to life under the golden rule. It's a ghastly thing, is it not? How are you faring so far? Ah, another stoic, perhaps. We all need something to help us through times like these. We've all been where you are now. I remember when I first arrived. I used to lay awake at night, contemplating the big questions. Why am I here? Is there a way out? What is the golden rule, and who or what is responsible for it? I still don't have any of the answers, I'm afraid. I don't think anybody does. But I'm happy to share with you what I've learned. Here, in this place, the Magistrate has me earning my keep by cleaning and pruning the gardens. It's not quite how I expected my life to go. I used to live in a lovely villa on the banks of the Tiber. I was even betrothed to a handsome young man from a prominent family. But long hours of menial labor for the good of the community has its own charms too, I suppose. Oh, much the same way as many of the others. When the fires came to Rome, seven months ago, my family and I fled for the Tiber, hoping to escape on a barge. We were among the fortunate ones with enough coins for passage, hmm. but unfortunately, there were a lot of desperate people, and they boarded before we could depart. A scuffle broke out, and I was pushed overboard. The last thing I remember was the water, rising up to hit my cheekbone. I woke up by the river, near that shrine, and stumbled across this place. Oh, that's all right. I'm sure it's all part of God's plan for me. Érdekes. Tehát ő is a, a, a folyón keresztül, a tűz idején. Még a tűz lehet egy, egy érdekes uh, pattern. Oh yes, of course. A slip of the tongue. Hmm. Octavia lenne, aki zaklatja a sváb srácot. If you like. Hmm. I'm afraid not. Although I did once hear someone gossiping down at Aurelia's tavern about a possible way out. I don't put a lot of stock in such rumors, but if you're desperate and wealthy, you could look into it, I suppose. If that doesn't work, then I suppose we're all stuck here until gods, uh, the gods, decide our fate. I hope it works out. Hmm. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. I think about those words a lot. I'd like to think that if we all love our neighbors as ourselves and do to them as we'd have them do to us, then we'll all be fine. But on the other hand, I was always taught the intent of man's heart is evil from his youth, and that all of us are born with a tendency towards sin. And that's where I get stuck. Is it true? Are we born with a tendency towards sin? Hát tudjátok, hogy én nagyon optimista vagyok. You don't think that's a little naive? Hmm. I suppose you've never seen what I've naive. seen. Igen, ez a jó Innocent szó. men and women, torn apart in arenas while thousands of Romans look on and cheer. Hát 
Hát, de tudjuk, hogy azoknak az időknek vége lett. Hmm. I wish I shared your faith. Please, please keep that to yourself. I know you're not from around here, but oh, things are very difficult for us right now. Hmm. There was a terrible fire in Rome last year, and our emperor decided to make us his scapegoats. There were executions. It was horrible. Oh, thank you. You have no idea how much I appreciate that. Yeah, All right. Well, it was lovely to meet you. I look forward to getting to know you better over the coming months. And if you ever I can't believe this is how it ends. Oh no. No. No, 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 no. Wolf Pierce, what are you doing? Wolf Pierce. From there. If you lose your balance, you'll fall. That's the idea. What? Why? Why would you want that? Why do you think I'm stuck for the rest of my life? Working for a man who treats me like an animal. I know, I know things are hard for you right now. They're hard for all of us. We're all in this together, Alpheus. Please, please just think this through. If you do this, it could be the sin that seals all of our fates. Is that what you want? I'm sorry, but I just don't care anymore. Please, Alpheus. Help him. If he goes through with it, it could be the end for us all. I don't know what to do. I've never had to deal with this sort of thing. Please, you need to talk to him. I don't know, but it's a crime for slaves to take their own lives. And a debt bondsman isn't far off. <laughs> Good luck, I'm out. <laughs> Thank you. And please, choose your words carefully. Let me some of your let me guess. You're going to lecture me on how suicide is a crime against the Empire. I screwed up my life. That's what's wrong. I borrowed money and when I couldn't pay it back, I wound up in debt bondage. I'll be stuck slaving away for that Culus Cumulatis Maliolus for the rest of my life. I am out. Wherever you are, Centilla, my love. I'm sorry. Opius, no! I... I can't believe he went through with it. I... Oh, Lord. That poor lamb. Well, I suppose it means suicide isn't a sin under the Golden Wall. So I guess that means whichever god is responsible for it, it isn't mine. PM? I'll have to let everyone know what happened. And I guess Maliolus will have to clean up the mess in his villa. It's of his own making, after all. And I'd best pray for poor Alpheus. Had... Ó, oh, és akkor ezért szalad el. Oké, okay, értem. Uh, Oké, okay, tehát uh, Ulpius nem sikerült megmentenünk. Um, és akkor ő vágott lyukat Meliolusnak a kertjébe, ezek szerint. Jó, hát... Um, aha. Ez zárva van. Mindjárt itt körülnézünk. De akkor uh, vannak itt keresztények egyébként. Uh, ezek szerint akkor nem csak Octavia az, hanem valószínű más is. Bár azon meglepődnék, hogyha uh, Octavia lenne az, aki zaklatja a sváb, sváb, sváb gyereket. Oké. 
És itt körbe-körbe szaladgálok. Megnézzük, hogy erre mi van, bár itt szerintem csak le lehet jönni a... Aha. Jó, először próbáljuk ki ezt a Meliolusos szállat, és akkor utána... Hát, ha, ha még élünk, akkor lecsúszunk ezen a, dró ezen a drót kötélem. Előtte mentek egyet. Csak hogy ne, hogy rossz helyre ugorjak véletlen. Did you just leap into my villa from the balcony a hundred feet above? That was either extremely reckless or impressively clever. Well, why have you risked life and limb to see me? <laughs> Are you insane? You barge into my villa uninvited and then make outrageous demands? Why would I withdraw from an election I'm bound to win? Hát, um... You fool. The many shall suffer Impossible. for the sins of the one. Mert le tudok innen kijutni, a kulcs. Sokos, köszönöm szépen a subgiftet, perokennek. <gül> Köszi szépen. Salve, friend. Mind telling me who you are and why you look like you've just taken on a gladiator and lost? Sounds serious. I'm listening. All right, let me see. Stop Fabia going in, but send the new arrival to the empty shrine. Understood. Oh, poor guy. My uncle was a victim at rheumatism's altar, and he ended up killing himself. All right, got it. I'll go. But once I'm done, I'll need you to tell me how you know all of this. Okay. Oh, Sherry Tadri, nagyon szépen köszönöm a százast. Nagyon szépen köszönöm a támogatást. Hát igen, megint elisztáltunk. Hogy kéne most? Szerintem menjünk el, vegyünk gyantát. Mert hogy van nálunk ezer... Ez a hang, ez rettenetes. Oh, stop soros. Nagyon szépen köszönöm az újabb subgiftet. Köszi szépen neked is ezt a sok-sok támogatást. Hello there, friend. May I say that is a glorious bow you're carrying. Do you mind if I ask where you acquired it? As I'm told, my high plane has has such mucidic. I'm not involved in it yet. 
Elvileg kéne, de Na, nem tudom. Hát most elmondjuk neki. Well, I'll take your word for it. But perhaps you'd be interested in selling it to me. I mean, it's not as if you have any use for it down here. Oh well. Szegény csávó. Certainly. All I ask is a reasonable price of a thousand denarii. Oh, you have it. I'm impressed. Pleasure doing business. Can I help you with anything else? I don't know. Just a few pins. Very well. Another time. When you must begin to use that to come back to the edge of the rest. I mean, the most likely. Look, Rachel. What are you doing in here? Can't you see this woman is dying? She's been poisoned. She needs the resin of a plant called silphium, but that Kulas Kubolates Desias won't give it to me. What? Quick, give it here. Yulia, Yulia, you need to swallow this. Here, let me help you. Hopefully, in a moment, she should be able to breathe normally. That was extraordinary. How did you know she needed this exact thing? And at this exact moment? Are you some kind of oracle? A what? I'm sorry, I must have misheard you. I think it's your accent, because it sounded like you said, time traveler. But whatever kind of traveler you are, that was like the gods hearing my prayers and intervening. You just saved a person's life, and you should be proud of yourself. She might even be able to thank you herself in a few moments. And maybe she can tell us who poisoned her, and who she meant when she was muttering about that snake's cruel black eyes. In the meantime, I'm happy to help you with whatever it is you need. De nem öngyilkossági kísérletet hajtott végre? Oh no, sorry, I don't mean to worry you, but no, that is definitely not normal. There was one other person who claimed she could hear the statues talking to her, but that was Nevia, and uh, she went a little mad. Hát igen, azt, uh, azt észrevettük. Well, she used to run the clinic. She was a midwife. Not a physician, no, but she was the closest thing we had down here, and she was good too, until she suddenly lost all interest in us. One day she told me she'd made some profound discovery about the golden statues. This changes everything, she kept saying, but I had no idea what she was talking about. The last time I saw her, the last time any of us saw her, she was muttering to the statues, like she could talk to them. And then she shut herself in the palace, barred the door from the inside, and nobody's seen her since. She's been gone so long now, we figure she's either dead or up to something so strange that she doesn't want anyone else to know about it. But I really wish I could reach her, because that's the only hope I have of solving a troubling problem, a real thorn in the poor situation. One of my patients is suffering from terrible rheumatism. His joints are inflamed. And he's in constant pain. He's become so irritable that the smallest things set him off. And I worry he'll end up losing his temper and lashing out. And you know what that means. I just know Nevia would know how to treat him, assuming she's still alive. But nobody seems to know how to get into the palace. You did? That's unexpected. But tell me, what is it? Willow back. I should have known. It was under my nose the whole time. That's very helpful. Thank you. If this works, it should settle Rufius down some. I have some right here. Could you do me a favor and give him some of this? He'll just need to swallow a pinch of it. I'm hoping it will avert disaster. 
de mondjuk ez már. Thank you. I'm really glad you arrived when you did. That's a shame. Ez már jó, hogy elvitte neki. Thanks again for saving Julia's life. Apollo smiles upon you. Super. Julia, mi a helyzet? Oh, it's you. Sorry, I'm still a bit out of it. But thanks for trying to help me. I suppose. Was there something you wanted? Lucretia says I'm supposed to rest. Igen, Tamás hát ele valóban nyomasztotta a szöveget. Mi történt? As much as I'm grateful that you tried to help me, it's just not safe for me to talk about it. Please, no more questions. Hmm. The golden rule. <laughs> That's the least of my worries. The gods may be cruel, but Maliolus and Claudia are far crueler. Please, just leave me alone. I don't want to talk about it. Had the Olivia said to you, Gosselet, what had? Akart lenni. Oh, persistent as nemesis, aren't you? I can tell you, but it's a long saga. Van időnk. All right. I'd been here about a week. When it dawned on me, I'd be trapped here for the rest of my life. I could hardly breathe, and I knew I had to get out somehow. So when my new friend Aurelia offered me a secret way out, I would have done anything. And then I learned her asking price. A thousand denarii. She was supposed to be my friend. I told her it would take me years to save up that much. So she suggested I take out a loan from Maliolus. And I did. So Maliolus took care Kölcsön. Mert azt gondolta, hogy mielőtt vissza kell adni a már ki, ki is juthat. I'm not proud of it, but yes, I was surprised he agreed to it, to be honest. But I was so happy to have the money I didn't question it. I had to sign an agreement saying I'd work off the debt over 30 years. But I figured I'd be out of here so soon it wouldn't matter. I paid Aurelia. And she gave me her so-called way out. Do you want to know what it was? Hemlock. Drink this, she said, and you'll be out of here in no time. Of course I demanded my money back, but she refused. She pointed to a sign on her tavern saying, let the buyer beware. Then she just looked at me with those cruel black eyes and she... She laughed. She immediately told Maliolus I'd tried to escape without paying him back. Only, he didn't seem upset or surprised at all. In fact, he just thanked her. And that's when I realized the two of them had planned the whole thing from the beginning. That's what I said to the magistrate. I went to Sentius and begged for help, but he said the law was clear. I'd signed over my labor for 30 years and there was nothing he could do. I thought about resisting too, but Maliola said if I didn't submit, I'd break the golden rule. And I couldn't be responsible for all those deaths, so he locked me in his villa, confiscated everything I owned as collateral, and made me wear immodest, humiliating outfits while I worked day in, day out. His wife Claudia was just as bad. She sent me to work on an endless stream of futile, 
demeaning tasks. I'd be on my hands and knees, scrubbing the floor clean for hours. Only for her to pour slop on it and hiss, you missed a spot. Those two took everything from me. <sighs> but they forgot to confiscate one thing. My hemlock. I just wanted it to be over. But it seems I messed that up too. Should have drunk all of it. I brought it on myself. I trusted one of the most callous human beings I've ever met, and tried to swindle the other. I don't know how I could have been so stupid. Okay, tehát a kocsmár, értem, értem a történetet. Akkor a kocsmáros az, aki egy ilyen, hát eléggé rossz ember, és ugye a Meliolus-szal közösen tervelték ezt ki. When I've recovered, I expect their thug Demitius will come for me. He'll escort me back to their villa, and I'll be right back where I started. Hmm. Only this time, I won't be able to lull myself to sleep at night with the thought of a permanent solution. Honestly, it would have been better if the poison had been allowed to run its course. I doubt it. It seems this is the fate the gods have chosen for me. For trying to escape. At least until someone breaks the golden rule. Huh. Maybe it wouldn't be so bad. A lot. But it doesn't matter. I... I made a suicide pact with Ulpius last night. He's in exactly the same position as I am. Maliolus and Aurelius set the same trap for him a month after they did it to me. He and I are in this together. He's probably already thrown himself from the bluff into Maliolus's villa by now. If hmm. so, I'd never be able to live with myself, knowing I broke my promise to him. Oké, okay, tehát akkor alapvetően úgy tudjuk megmenteni Ulpius-t, hogy mondjuk, hogy Julia nem fog meghalni, mert kiváltjuk. I doubt you could make it up to the bluff in time. I don't know who you are, or why you seem so determined to help me, but... Thank you. Hát... Um, ezzel már nem tudom mit kezdeni, de... Um, mert ugye ő már leugrott. Hmm, a ugye? golden bow, just like Apollo and Diana's. Hmm. De ő nem leugrott, vagy azóta, vo ja, azóta volt reset? Persze azóta volt izé reset. Igen, és akkor 2000 kell, mert uh, akkor őt is ki kell váltani, gondolom. De mindegy más nem azt mondjuk, hogy Júlia nem halt meg, mert megmentettük, hát ha az is, az is elegendő. Esetleg öt kát megpróbálni, így van, így van, nevermind, azt is megpróbálhatjuk. Legfeljebb azt mondja, hogy az, az tényleg túl sok. Ulpius? Salve, friend! I'm Octavia. Jó van. Welcome to life under the golden rule. It's a ghastly thing, is it not? How are you faring so far? All right. Well, it was lovely to meet you. I look forward to getting to know you better over the coming months. And if you ever... I can't believe this is how it ends. Oh, no. No. No, 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 no. Wolf Pierce, what are you doing? Get back from there. If you lose your balance, you'll fall. That's the idea. What? Why? Why would you want that? Why do you think I'm stuck for the rest of my life? Working for a man who treats me like an animal. I know, I know things are hard for you right now. They're hard for all of us. We're all in this together, Alpheus. Please, please just think this through. If you do this, it could be the sin that seals all of our fates. Is that what you want? I'm sorry, but I just don't care anymore. Please, Alpheus. 
Help him. If he goes through with it, it could be the end for us all. I don't know what to do. I've never had to deal with this sort of thing. Please, you need to talk to him. Thank you. And please, choose your words carefully. You know about that? How is that possible? I mean, I've never mentioned it to anyone. Well, if you say so. You don't understand. I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want it all to be over. It's too late for that. Yulia and I made a pact. And she's already swallowed no, you David took. If I backed out now, I'd be betraying her. I can't do that. Oh, really? That changes things a little. But we're still in debt bondage to that monster. Unless you happen to have 2,000 denarii to pay off both of our debts. <laughs> Hát ettől biztos leugrik. Még úgy se tudunk, tehát egy lúbban nem tudunk. De mondjuk lehet, hogy tudunk. Hát az 5000-et megpróbáljuk kicsalni a, a, a gyökérkereskedőtől. Mondjuk mindegy, alapvetően. No. No. Time's up. I am out. Where are you are? Centilla, my love. I'm sorry. Opius, no! Jó, akkor most megyünk. Um... I... I can't believe he went through with it. That was not your fault. There's no way you could have given him what he wanted, moments after you arrived. I'll have to let everyone know what happened. And I'd better... Jó, akkor menjünk a... Melyik lehet a legrövidebb út? Ezután nem ugrunk le. Próbáljuk megmenteni őket. Mettünk volna a dróton is, na mindegy. Én gyorsabban futok. Today is a sad day. Citizen. Citizen. Csetleg beszélni Marshmallow-val, hogy... Na, hol vagy? Savos. Wonder how much one of these statues is worth on the outside. Hello there, friend. May I say that is a glorious bow you're carrying. Do you mind if I ask where you acquired it? Well, I'll take your word for it. But perhaps you'd be interested in selling it to me. I mean, it's not as if you have any use for it down here. Now you're talking, I'm interested. How about a hundred denarii? Hát tudunk kétezret is kérni, amúgy. Hú, oh, that's a little excessive, don't you think? It's not the bow of Ulysses we're talking about. All right, all right. But I'm going to need you to tell me before I pay up. Wait, wait, wait. Let's not be too hasty, friend. I just want a little assurance that I can trust you, that's all. Hmm. I suppose you're right. All right, you drive a hard bargain, but here's your money. Now, the location of that bow. Uh, what? But I already knew that, you imbecile. Everyone knows that. I can't take that golden bow because stealing from the goddess in her own shrine would break the golden rule. You promised to tell me where I could get one of my own. What is this? Some kind of joke? I don't believe this is happening. 
Okay. Don't even talk to me. Jó, na most valahogy triggerelni kéne a resetet. Um. De hogy? Lelőhetem, de ne, még mindig nem tudom, hogy... Hogy mivel veszem elő a fegyvert. Esetleg... De ö, az szerintem a, a automatikusan vette elő, mert amúgy már functionnek kéne beszólni. Ö, és mi, mi? Megnézem. <tos> Balegérgomb. De erre meg nem veszi elő. Nem veszi elő. Görgővel veszi elő. Jó. Oké. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Na, jó, meg az a fontos. Na, haladj. A oh, stop soros. Köszönöm szépen ismét a subgiftet. Ezúttal Edwinnek. Um, Na, ezt nézzük szerintem még. Um, hogy is legyen? Szerintem álljunk meg itt ma, és akkor innen folytatjuk. Jó? Seni Tadri közben köszönöm a tízest. Köszi szépen. Szerintem ma megállunk, mert most már kezd későre járni. Um, Folytatjuk mindenképp, majd ö, jövő héten, még nem tudom pontosan mikor, de okvetlenül, okvetlenül folytatjuk, jó? Ö, csak ne felejtsem el, hogy, 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 hogy hol is járunk a sztoriba, majd igyekszem, ö, igyekszem nem elfelejteni, jó? Úgyhogy... Ö, Stopsoros mindenképp, ö, szerintem csütörtök lesz egyébként, mert ugye szerdán Life is Strange van, ugye az a szokásos menetrend szerint, és akkor szerintem csütörtökön folytatjuk ezt, de ha szerdán benézel a menetrendbe már benne lesz biztosan, lekéred a bottal, és akkor ott már látni fogod, az se kizártam úgy, hogy, hogy szombaton, de ezt majd meglátjuk, még, még nem biztos. Jó. Oké, és na hát jó, jó, jó játék mindenképpen, nagyon tetszik. Az biztos, hogy sokat beszélnek benne, ami külön érdekessé teszi. Nem csak lövöldözni kell, meg, meg ütni az ellenfelet. Szóval tényleg jó. Fogjuk még mindenképp, tehát ezt mindenképp végigjátszuk, ezt tuti. 
Na, én megköszönöm ezt a sok-sok támogatást, a rengeteg uh, subgiftet, uh, csírt, donation-t, uh, a followokat, mindent nagyon szépen köszönök, de legfőképpen az, hogy itt voltatok és néztétek. Um, én kívánok nektek további kellemes estét, kellemes hétvégét, holnap pedig találkozunk, folytatjuk a Gadofort, ha minden igaz, és ha jól haladunk, akkor, akkor be is fejezzük, legalábbis a main story-t mindenképp, aztán majd meglátjuk, hogy fogunk-e még valkülözni utána. Legyen további szép estétek, sziasztok!